trip here on the last week of the regular season with one more to go on Sunday at home. It is the Pelicans and the Warriors, and it's coming your way on the Pelicans Radio Network. Here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude Perfect smoothie with Smoothie King. Uh, We is strong. It's my recipe. Technically, we all came up with it, Kobe. I mean, you put a potato in yours. I was experimenting. Yeah, we picked up on that. (laughs) Guys, this is fruit smoothie perfection. I even heard it recently quoted that it was food perfect. (laughs) Yeah, I was on the same. Oh, that was was funny. Oh, honey. Thank you. (laughs) Anyways, get the Dude Perfect smoothie only at Smoothie King. My smoothie. Hey, basketball fans, ready to score some cash back? Tip off your shopping trips with the Ibotta app or browser extension and get cash back on groceries and more. Start with Ibotta to find offers at hundreds of your favorite retailers from groceries and home improvement to sporting goods and apparel. Then shop as usual in store or online. The average saver earns over $100 per year. Download the free app or browser extension and start earning cash back today. Ibotta, cash back made easy. Ibotta is a proud sponsor of the New Orleans Pelican. Hi, this is Quentin. And this is Brianna. A little thing we love about Chick-fil-A chicken strips are how satisfying they are. The chicken strips are amazing. They're always filling, tender and juicy. Definitely one of my favorite things on the menu. My favorite thing is the last bite. The last bite is nice and juicy, and it's wrapped up in some crispy breading that keeps it nice and tasty. And being able to scoop up my Chick-fil-A sauce with it, it's just like the best part of the meal. It's an undefeated combo. Order the chicken strips on the Chick-fil-A app today. Real customers paid for their testimonials. Back at Chase Center, Todd Ravenini, John DeShays are with you. Next to San Francisco Bay here, beautiful facility. In San Francisco, it's the Pelicans and the Warriors coming up for you. Time now for our starting lineups. First for the visiting Pelicans, 48-32 on the year. A franchise record 27 wins away from home against 14 losses. Still six in the Western Conference. Controlling your own destiny for number six on the third-year head coach, Willie Green. C.J. McCollum, 6'3 guard, Lehigh. Oh, well, McCollum, he will take the three. Yeah, you're right. Herbert Jones, 6'6", six, six, Alabama. Turf Jones, they leave Malone. He's going to drive into the lane and high off the glass with a scooping lefty shot. Zion Williamson, 6'7", forward, Duke. Zion's got 25. Size it up, Dirk. It takes it right at him. They will throw it down with a right hand, big <laughs> Trey Murphy, 6'9", forward, Virginia. This the finger roll. Follow it up. With a two-hand flush by Kenneth Murphy the third. Jonas Valanciunas, 6'11 center, left was Ritas, Lithuania. Wesley, eight feet away, and Jonas just stuffs it flat-footed. For the Golden State Warriors, they are 45 and 35 right now, sitting ninth in the Western Conference. Same records as Sacramento and the Lakers. Those games are pending, so they need to win to try to get a home game. In the play-in, their record at home, though, is 20-19, and 19, which is very un-warrior-like under 10th-year head coach Steve Kerr. I think you'll recognize most of the starting lineup here, Stephen Curry, Clay Thompson, Andrew Wiggins, and Draymond Green. The man you might not recognize is rookie Trace Jackson Davis, who has been a find for the Warriors. He's got five double-doubles and is averaging nearly a double-double in the last three weeks, and he has really picked up the slack at the five as they have been hit with injury has Golden State. Those are your starting lineups. Your inactive list presented by Morris Bart. Official injury warrior of the Pelicans, Brandon Ingram. Left knee boat contusion. Najee Marshall is out tonight. Left shoulder contusion. Larry Nance Jr. Personal reasons. And Darian Sebron two-way. Those are particulars. Keys and tip next. Sports played on a field or ice or course. The rivers is the place. Over under money line, singing parlays, it's all fine. You put a smile on your face. Bet on the sports you love with Bet River Sportsbook. Take a chance. Must be 21 plus. Available in Louisiana only. Void were prohibited. Terms and conditions apply. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER. Offered in partnership with Bossier Casino Venture Incorporated. DBA Margaritaville Resort Casino. Chevron with Tecron has unbeatable engine cleaning power, and it gives you unbeatable mileage for all kinds of unbeatable destinations, like time in the sun at the beach, or time in the sun riding roller coasters, or a day in the sun hiking mountains. 
Well, probably just one mountain would be enough for a day, but hiking a mountain is still an unbeatable choice for how to spend time. Download the Chevron app now to get unbeatable mileage at locations near you. Nate Barkonsi, the Be Funny Tour. I mean, Chuck E. Cheese is rough. I don't know if you've been there in a while. They look like they're trying to go to business and they can't. All new material. They filed for bankruptcy and they're still open. They call Bloodbuster and they're like, how do you get out? We want out. Nate Barkonsi, May 30th, Smoothie King Center. Tickets available at Ticketmaster.com. Produced by Outback Presents. Don't miss Nate Barkonsi, the Be Funny Tour. This radio presentation of the New Orleans Pelicans is brought to you by Chevron, the human energy company. Behind the back flip, bounce feed to Zion and drives it and throws it down with a left hand. Cox, bringing us closer. Energy, we power life. Brute force. Zion says, uh, no you don't, Beard. I bought a cash back made easy. And by Smoothie King, rule the day. P.I. drives in. Finger roll. Cheers, Don Graffanini. Wow. All right, here we go, baby. It's the Pelicans and the Warriors from the city by the bay. Tonight's keys to the game presented by Ibotta. Ibotta, cash back made easy. If you're the Pelicans, do not panic. This is the team that takes threes and makes threes. About 15 a game they make on 39 attempts. Those are both top five in the league. You know they're going to make some of them. Don't panic when they do. And also, got to keep this team off the offensive glass. 12 offensive rebounds a game. That's fifth most in the league. 16 second chance points. That's fifth most in the league. The Pelicans will have to box out and rebound. Officiating crew tonight. David Guthrie, the crew chief. John Butler, the referee. Brett Nansel is the umpire. Pels in the White Association edition uniforms. And all blue gold lettering for the Dubs. Valanchunas and Jackson Davis in the center circle. Pels will go left to right. Warriors right to left. You know it's at stake, ladies and gentlemen. We're not going to scoreboard watch here. we got to take care of our own business. Jonas wins the tip. And Herb Jones will walk it into the front court for the first possession of this ball game. Zion, who had 31 last night, get it down low right through the hands of Trey Murphy but we'll get it back. What a pass by Zion and Trey. I mean, that went right through his hands. He's got a, he's got a dunk. If it's a clean catch, he's got yeah. he's got an uncontested layup or dunk. Just got to make a clean catch. Yeah, both these teams played last night. Inbound to McCollum. As Clay Thompson closed out on him, goes around a Valanchunas pick, get it to Murphy. Double clutch, drive, get it to Z. Back to Murphy, right wing three. He popped it, and it's too strong. Rebound off of Valanchunas' hands. And out of bounds. Is there is there Vaseline on the ball already? That's twice. Well, he's wrestling a, a little bit with Steph Curry on that one. All right, Draymond Green's going to bring it in the front court to Jackson Davis. Talented rookie. Thompson off the curl for three. Short. Tipped and taken by Herb. Again, you just mentioned it. One and done is the key defensively for New Orleans. Now Z, post down low. Powers left. Floats it up, no. Rebound, Jonas. Stick back in with two hands over the front iron. Well, well, JV has the size advantage over Trace Jackson, so he should be able to hopefully capitalize on second chance points for himself. All right, now Curry hook pass to Jackson Davis to a cutting Wiggins. Beautiful pass, and Wiggins floats it in, finger roll style. Now will alley oop it, and that is a horrible pass from Herb Jones to Zion. It, hit the backboard. Thompson bounce feed to Jackson Davis. He loses it, but maintains control on the baseline right block. Again, what's up with the basketball right now? Oh, that was just a bad pass. He threw it too hard. Now, Thompson is hounded by Herb. Get it up to Green. Whip it down low. Chest pass to Jackson Davis. He'll get an easy layup. Yeah, he beat Jonas Valanciunas baseline. That's an easy lay-in. But the Pels already with a couple of careless plays. 4-2 Golden State. McCollum through three defenders, get it to Herb up top. Trey fly by Wiggins drives in and lays it in finger roll style over the front iron. That's the power move we've been looking for him to make. And we don't get back really in transition. And Wiggins gets to the rim, and Herb Jones well picks up his first foul a minute and fifty seven seconds. Well, in. that's just transition basketball. You make a layup on one end, and the guy is 
attempting a layup on you on the other off the fast break. That can't happen. There's no reason you shouldn't have the defensive rotation. And again, Herb, you can almost set your watch by it. Picking up his first foul in the first two minutes as Wiggins knocks the free throw down his 10th year out of Kansas. Yeah, he gets the cheat when it's been such a blessing for the Pels to have Dyson Daniels back. Because if Herb gets into foul trouble, you can bring in Dyson. So Wiggins, who has really come on as of late, averaging 13 a game, four and a half rebounds, knocks them both down. 76% at the line is Wiggins. And Golden State leads six to four. We're two minutes in. McCollum gets free. Stop, pop, straightaway three. Nope. And the rebound, Jackson Davis. Quickly into the front court. They are pushing the issue. Curry, float a fall away, left of the lane, no good. McCollum with the uncontested rebound. They beat Portland in Portland last night by 10. McCollum drives in, misses the floater. Rebound, Draymond Green. So the Pels are off to a cold start here. Three balls, step. Oh, no, that was a pass to yeah. Trace Jackson Davis, and that was over everybody out of bounds. So it is a sluggish start on both sides. That pass was worse than the one Herb attempted for, for Zion. <laughs> That one just got away from Curry. Now Z at the dotted line, floats up the midi. That won't go. Rebound Green, who has already cleaned up three boards. Wiggins for three right angle. No. Weak side rebound, Valanchunas. Still six to four with three minutes in. Herb's open left corner. He'll pop a three. No good. Rebound, Jackson Davis. Oh, we got a whole lot of sound and fury signifying nothing right now. Both teams going up and down. Can't make a bucket. Pels are two of eight. And 0 of 3 from distance. Thompson off the curl. Start, stops, pulls up from 10. No. Rebound, Trey Murphy. Still 6 to 4. Herb, left wing. On court, get it to Valanchunas up top. Shovels it to Murphy. He'll pop a 3 left side, high off the heel. Green taps the rebound. Valanchunas got hit in the head. He's grabbing his uh, head. Get, he guess rebound. by who he got hit. I, I'll, I'll give you one guess. Wiggins, beautiful crossover on McCullum. Euro's in, and no, but a foul. So Andrew Wiggins will take his third and fourth free throws already as McCullum picks up his first. Pels cannot make a shot here in the San Francisco Bay. Yeah, he got the mismatch against C.J. McCollum and immediately goes after the smaller defender, and neither team has scored since... In four minutes. So Wiggins is, boy, he got like a library in here, makes the free throw. And so it's for a score in 100 seconds. This is a drought of a game. Again, both teams played last night. We bust over from Sacramento. They made that short flight from Portland, which, of course, we just did find into Sacramento. So both teams got in relatively early when you're thinking about a back-to-back because you never know what time you're going to get in. But both teams should be well-rested here. Pell's trailing now 8-4. to four. Valanchunas, left block, backing down Jackson Davis, spins, throws it up. Late whistle, didn't go, but that is a foul on the rookie, Trace Jackson Davis from Indiana. Yeah, Jackson Davis got under his body on that one. Jonas takes advantage of it. <laughs> That was a late whistle, but a definite foul. So they are without Jonathan Kaminga and Gary Payton the second tonight. And that's big for Golden State because Kaminga has been playing like a monster for them. Well, and it takes away some of their bench production, which they've been, Jonas makes the first, one of the better teams in the league in terms of bench production. So, so Valanchunas, who picked up his 33rd double-double last night in Sacramento. Played 33 minutes, had 13 points and 10 rebounds. But he just does such a great job on DeMontis Sabonis. As Valanchunas makes both free throws. Well, you used the word the last two games regarding he and regarding uh, Cody. Professionals. No doubt. Wiggins in the paint. Beautiful backdoor cut, but he missed the layup. Back tapped out to Murphy, and the Pels are running. Herb Jones, front court, leave it for Trey. Extra pass Zion. Can Draymond Green front him? He spins, he throws it up. He got some arm. A lot of arm. This, see, this is what I'm afraid of tonight. Green's running the floor. He will float it up. 
off the glass, and that is a dunk for Jackson Davis. Yeah, that's a pass. And Zion Williamson cannot allow himself to get frustrated. And look, they're going to try to frustrate him. Draymond yeah. Green is going to do exactly what he's doing right now. Yeah, and, and he's got to maintain his composure because he's going to take some fouls, and he's not going to get that call. Another strip and a steal. Curry. No look pass to Jackson Davis. Goes in, missed the shot, but there's Trey, uh, Clay Thompson to clean it up. And Willie Green has to take a timeout. Oh, the Pelicans are frustrated already because they're not getting the calls. There's contact, and they hadn't been able to get the calls. And assistant coach Jaron Jackson at the officials right now as we speak. So we'll take a timeout. 12-6 Golden State, 7-13 left first quarter in the Pelicans Radio Network. Here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude Perfect smoothie with Smoothie King. Uh, we is strong. It's my recipe. Technically, we all came up with it, Kobe. I mean, you put a potato in yours. I was experimenting. Yeah, we picked up on that. Guys, this is fruit smoothie perfection. I even heard it recently quoted that it was food perfect. <laughs> yeah, I was on the same. Oh, it was, it was funny. Oh, honey. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, get the Dude Perfect smoothie only at Smoothie King. My smoothie. SeatGeek's the ticketing app for fans like the sideline shot caller. Come on, boys, pick up the pace. SeatGeek got him a great deal on seats right near the action, so when he yells, What are you doing? Block him! He'd be absolutely sure the players heard him. SeatGeek handles the tickets to sports, concerts, and more, so fans can fan. Entergy works for the moments you live for, the joy. Heart. Here's your boy. The wonder. And if we do this, our robot should. Cool. At Entergy, we're dedicated to powering each moment, today and for future generations. We're leading the way with a cleaner, more reliable grid to power every day. Because these moments matter. Your graduating class. We power life. Entergy. Brooks and Dunn Reboot 2024 Tour. I'll play something country. The best selling duo of all time. Alive. With David Lee Murphy. A little dust on the body. And Ernest. May 16th, Smoothie King Center. On sale now at Ticketmaster.com. Brooks and Dunn Live. A lot of other fans going to be like, oh, I did not know he had that, like the young people say, in his bag. <laughs> oh, Zion's going to do a whole lot of hold my beer in the playoffs. <laughs> After tonight, the Pels return home on Sunday, close out the regular season as we host the L.A. Lakers during Fan Fest. We'll be celebrating with a pregame party featuring Honey Island Swamp Band, and fans will be able to purchase single-day Jazz Fest tickets with no fees. Also, Big Sam's Funky Nation will be performing at halftime. Fans in attendance will receive a special flag courtesy of drums while supplies last. Secure your tickets now by visiting pelicans.com slash promotions. How important that game will be Sunday? Still to be determined. Hell's ball out of the break. Trailing 12 to 6. New Orleans is having all kind of problems putting the ball in the hole right now. Well, and this is about playing through contact and maintaining composure. Assume you're not going to get the call. Now Zion backing down Draymond Green. Double back out to McCullum. Fly by Wiggins. Drives in off the glass. Did you get the roll? Nothing is going for New Orleans right now. Bells are 2 of 11. Curry off the curl. Bounce feed to Jackson Davis. Left hand point. They're making it look extremely easy. Right oh, now. that's the one that can't happen because you got to get the proper defensive rotation. That's Zion Williamson on the rotation. He gets over there late, and that's an easy dunk to Jackson Davis. Well, hopefully some energy coming off the bench with Alvarado and Daniels there at the scores table. Herb drives in, throws up a wild shot. And we better be careful. Pajemski front court. They might run us out of the gym here in the first quarter. Curry, he hits a three. This place is going to go bonkers on cue. Yep. Right angle. It's a 9 0 run. So watch out. 17 6. Sold out venue already hopping. Williamson throws it out to Herb. Extra pass Murphy. They're not giving us any open looks either, folks. McCollum drives on Wiggins. Running floater. Short. 
Rebound, Pajemski. They're off and running again. Pajemski, another talented rookie for the Dubs. To Wiggins for three. All around and out, boy. But the Pels offense is non-existent. McCollum. As, I mean, Valanchunas is being decapitated by it. Draymond Green. They got it. Who has all the nerve to argue this with John Butler. I mean, you could hear Jonas screaming from up here. Valanchunas laid it in and won. Well, he's got his arm locked the entire time. You can and literally hell Jonas crying for help. Look, man, I mean, well, you, we've seen Draymond Green Come before. On. And we know what his thing is. His shtick is to frustrate you. He's got his arm the entire time. Free throw no good. So, you know, you get the bucket, but you miss the free throw. 17-8. 5-15 left in the first quarter. Curry. Right elbow pop. 19-8. Yep. Yeah. He catches off the curl, and Jose Alvarado is chasing him, so he takes a dribble inside the three-point line, pulls up for the open look. Jose Alvarado got clocked in the face they call. by they call, Steph Curry. It. That's a birthday call right there. Jose celebrating his birthday tonight. I tell you what, we better start bringing it because if we don't, yeah, that's fine. But you already see what they want to do to the Pelicans. They are going to try to out-physical you all night long, and right now they're doing it. And you better be up to the challenge or we're going to lose by 35 points. Well, we've seen that before. Williamson top of the key. Handed off to Murphy. Guarded by Moody. Drives in. Terrible pass, but we get it back with Williamson, and that is an angry dunk. That is chicken salad right there, but you'll take it. Yeah, and he benefits Draymond Green on the bench. So that was Kevon Looney trying to guard him. All right, so they've got Wiggins, Curry, Looney, Moody, and Pajemski on the floor. Pajemski, one-on-one with Dyson Daniels, and Zion just stripped it, and then Wiggins got it back. To Curry, double clutch three, short. Rebound Dyson Daniels. Outlet to Williamson running the floor. Z had a steam. Drives and blows the finger roll. Dump the ball up the floor, Curry. One take the three. Drives in. Reverse. Kick it out to Moody. Fake the three. Left corner, Curry. Curry hounded by Dyson Daniels. He'll step back. Won't take a shot. Fling it out long to Wiggins. Wiggins spins left. Leans in. Floats it up. No. Rebound Looney, which he will do. Shot no. Foul yes. Kevon Looney has killed us on the offensive glass his entire career. That's two fouls on Herb Jones. I, we already said this is an offensive rebounding team. They're going to offensive rebounds, so you've got to mind yourself. And now you're a little bit undersized with Valanciunas on the bench, so you really got to be careful. Now Herb Jones got to go to the bench because he's got a couple of fouls. So they're just coming in in waves here are the Warriors and the Pels. Do not look like the Pels tonight. 3.59 to go in the first quarter. We got 10 points. Free throw is good by Looney. Clay Thompson in. Wiggins out. And Chris Paul, yippee, will check in for Steph Curry. For, for Steph Curry. Chris Paul did not play in the January game here as he was injured. There's Jeremiah Robinson Earl in for the Pelicans to hopefully give him a little bit more size. 21-10, Golden State. Alvarado, Daniels, Murphy, Williamson, and JRE. Zion drives on Looney, got to the rim, blows another layup. Rebound Pajemski, up the floor Thompson. He'll go coast to coast, kick it out long to Paul. Paul will bounce feed it to Thompson. And then back it way, way out. Sizing up Zion 101. Left hand dribble all the way to the rim. Strip, got it back. Get it out to Pajemski for three left at the top. Brick, long rebound, Trey Murphy. Look, the Pills are getting shots. He's got to make some layups. We're four of 17. And Williamson's one for six. Yeah, and probably four of those have been layups that he's missed. He's got it again. Whip it out to Jose. Extra pass, JRE, left corner three. There you go. Barely fluttered the net. And Steve Curry goes, what? They hit a three? Let's take a timeout. 
Look, and that's the shot Golden State will settle for all night long. They will allow JRE to take that shot. He's going to have to make several more. If you had Jeremiah Robinson Earl making the first three-pointer of the night for the Pelicans on your bingo card, congratulations, you win. 3-10 to go first quarter. Golden State 21, New Orleans 13 on the Pelicans Radio Network. For the 2024 election on Sirius XM. The fight for our democracy. That's been the work of my first term. Thrilled to be back with thousands of proud American patriots. Where every voice matters. I'm as far left as you can get. This president has not complied with his oath. Left, right, center, decided, or undecided. We have to use our voices. We have to stand up for what we believe. The only place for every perspective and your voice about your vote on Sirius XM. Your basketball talk with the passion you deserve on NBA Today. It's Brian Winhurst of ESPN. Somebody is going to see how smart it would be to go be with Victor Wembanyama. Who in the league is going to see the lay of the land and say, get me to San Antonio? Not going to be a guy who's in his third or fourth year. It's going to be a guy who's a little older who recognizes that this guy is going to make me a megastar. NBA Today, weekdays from 4 to 7 p.m. Eastern, only on Sirius. XM NBA Radio Channel 86 and the all new Sirius XM app. This is PGA Tour Pro Smiley Kaufman, and I'm happy to announce that you can now hear me on Sports Grid Radio. Just in time for the Masters, I'm bringing my show, The Smiley Show, to Channel 159, where I'll catch up with other golfers, athletes, and celebrities. John Ralph becomes the fourth Spaniard to win at Augusta. Join me every Tuesday and Thursday at 7 a.m. and 1 p.m. in the East on Sports Grid Radio. Channel 159 in your car and on the all-new Sirius XM app. Merging influences from Afropop to chamber music, Vampire Weekend helped reshape the sound of indie rock and alternative. As their fifth album, Only God Was Above Us, arrives, hear the story behind it. I just started playing this riff. This had the feel of a good, simple pop song. Alongside nearly two decades of indie classics. Vampire Weekend Radio, all month in the Sirius XM app. On the court, off the court, and on devices equipped with Amazon Alexa. For the best basketball insight, just say, Alexa, listen to NBA Radio on Sirius XM. Okay. Money line, same game, Parlay, it's all fine. You put a smile on your face. Bet on the sports you love with Bet River Sportsbook. Take a chance. Must be 21 plus. Available in Louisiana only. Void were prohibited. Terms and conditions apply. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER. Offered in partnership with Bossier Casino Venture Incorporated. DBA Margaritaville Resort Casino. Golden State ball out of the break. Up eight, three minutes to go in the first quarter. Pajemski, Paul, Moody, Thompson, and Green for the Doves. Paul get it to Thompson, extra pass to Moody, short corner left, 15-footer, around and out, rebound Dyson Daniels. Golden State 7 of 19 from the floor. The Pels are 5 of 18. Yeah, they like Golden State's cooking yet. All right, Zion up top, Jose. They left him alone. Birthday 3. Nope. Back tapped out by Dyson to Z through three defenders and finally gets a bucket from about five feet away. Well, he's missed a couple of uncontested ones. Maybe he needs some degree of difficulty as he had on that one. All right, 21-15. Thompson, left wing, guarded by the smaller Alvarado. Drives left free throw line extended. Pops the mid-range. No, another rebound for Dyson Daniels. That's four already. Now McCollum crosses over Thompson. Whip it out left corner GRE. Extra pass to the slicing Z. Z fall away dotted line around and out. Had a couple, had a couple of short jumpers that well, have not gone for it. You got to make, you got to yeah. make shots. Yeah, you got to make them. Got to make them. Green guarded by Alvarado. There's a mismatch in it. Jose picked his pocket, and they're going to call Alvarado for the foul. Thought he had the strip. Uh, he had to go through him to get it. You could probably count on one hand the amount of times this year Zion Williamson has been two for eight. And they're all within five feet. Yeah, everything's at the rim. What he's got to do, and he's talking to the officials as he goes to the bench, he's got to play through his frustration. He's got to make the assumption he's not going to get the call. And all of that, that frustration is boiling, you know, boiling over. All right, Looney in for Green. Paul will inbound to Thompson. Get it back to CP, and Dyson poked it into the backcourt. Race for the basketball. JRE tried to save it. Now, 
He dove for it in front of the double. Oh, the bench. official. Whoa. The official, I think he just pointed the wrong way. Yeah, Nansel pointed the Pelicans' way. Let's see. I mean, it yeah. should be. Yeah, I mean, he just oh, pointed the wrong way. Oh, oh, you see what happened? JRE saved it, and he threw it off of Chris Paul's knee. Oh, wow. Yes. That's an, oh, yes, he did. That's an yes, unbelievable he did. play. Can that be a spark? Murphy for three. No, of course not. Rebound, Clay Thompson. That's a great hustle play. It was, and you don't get rewarded as Paul bricks a three right wing. This is an ugly fest. Pels are only down six. McCollum, shot fake, drives into the paint, reverse layup, missed another one. He can't get anything going. Nobody can get anything going. 115 left in the quarter. Looney right elbow. Get it to Paul. Float it down. Low post right Thompson. There's the double. Back to CP. Whip it to Pajemski. Lefty three. Hit it. That's good ball movement. You draw the double team. You kick it out. You swing it. And there's a wide open shooter at the other end of it. Rookie out of Santa Clara. 19th pick in the draft. Brandon Pajemski gives the Dubs a 24-15 lead. Pels cannot make anything. McCollum, bumped by Paul, who stripped it, took it, up the floor. Thompson drives in, blocked from behind by McCollum, and we get it with Daniels. Outlet pass to Murphy. Loses the dribble, somehow found JRE for three. In and out. Rebound, Chris Paul. Oh, my kingdom for a bucket. Yep. Paul will go coast to coast and float it up, and no. Rebound, Looney. In. 26-15, this is what I was petrified of before the game started. Oh, Looney just bigs you, and that's what he's doing against this smaller lineup. Even though JRE is out there, Looney has the size and weight advantage on him. And he's able to go through it. Well, after a record-setting first quarter in this building in January, polar opposite here tonight, McCollum. Running floater is good from the dotted line. Well, did he need that? Look, Moody will not get the shot to go at the buzzer. And a very lackluster offensive quarter for the Pelicans. Yet you look up and you're only down nine. Yeah, it could be a whole lot worse. The Pels did not shoot worth anything in the quarter. Seven of 26. <laughs> the only saving grace is Golden State's 9 of 24. So that's the only reason the Pels are close in this one. We'll head to the second, 26 17. Warriors over the Pelicans on the Pelicans Radio Network. Janet Jackson presents Together Again, live for one incredible night in New Orleans. Janet Jackson performing all her number one hits with special guest Nelly. Smoothie King Center, July 23rd. Get tickets now at Ticketmaster.com. Janet Jackson with special guest Nelly. For more, visit JanetJackson.com. Pell fans, did you know the best burger in New Orleans is actually in Metairie? Atomic Burger has become a fan favorite thanks to big, exciting flavors. People love their bacon jam burger, their Nashville hot chicken sandwich, and their Nutella marshmallow shake. Plus, they do everything right. They grind their beef in-house every day, hand-cut their fries, and they won't start cooking until you place your order. Started right here in Louisiana, Atomic Burger has locations in Metairie, Baton Rouge, and Prairieville. Check them out. The NBA app is everyone's app. Every fan of every team. Oh, my goodness. Everyone who follows LeBron, Tatum, and Embiid in the app. Every warrior who's ready to go to battle with the three-point percentages. Every streetwear king who's here for the tunnel fits. Every young buck, nugget, and grizzly who wants to take a peek behind the scenes of the league. And everyone else on this floating basketball we call Earth. Download the NBA app today. Available in the Google Play, Apple app, and Android stores. Zion drives on Fournier, gets bumped, throws it up, got the roll with a left hand, flex that left bicep Z. Now, here's Todd Graffanini. Hey, Pels fans, tickets for the postseason are on sale today. We need you to pack the SKC, bring all your energy and one NOLA vibe to our exciting matchups. Don't miss out on these amazing moments with your Pelican squad as we begin our championship quest. Secure your seats now by visiting pelicans.com slash tickets. Will it be a play-in game on Tuesday or a playoff game next, I mean, next, next week? That's what's still to be determined. 
Right now we start the second quarter with Golden State up 26-17. Now just an ugly offensive quarter for the Pels. 7-26 from the field, 1-8 of eight from 3. Hopefully they will warm to the occasion here. All right, Paul's got it. Pick and roll with Looney, and now we leave Malone, and that's a layup for him. Right baseline, 8 feet. Yeah, you got some confusion on the zone. Pell switch to zone defensively. Chris Paul dribbles to the baseline, and everybody leaves it. Daniels, Murphy, McCollum, Valanchunas, and Alvarado on the floor. Valanchunas has a left block. Just pop a five-footer and hit it right over Looney. He just faced the hoop. Didn't even bring the ball below his shoulder. Yeah, every now and again, he'll use that as a pump fake. At that time, he squeezes it off. Valanchunas has eight points by far our leading scorer. Paul, left free throw line extended, another mid-range. No, weak side rebound McCollum. 28-19 Warriors, one minute gone in the second. CJ, whip it to Valanchunas out top. Now Alvarado right wing. Jose, low post right Jonas, guarded by Looney. Spins left, still dribbling. Oh, Pumped gosh. off his spot. Get it to McCollum. Close out Pajemski. McCollum weaves through to the nail. Bounce feed down low. Jonas strip on his way up. That's a strip. Evidently by Looney. Well, Look, I, I'm just telling you right now. We are getting nothing tonight. So just accept it. That's the way it's going to be. That's hard to accept. That's, that is hard to accept. That's just the way it's going to be. We've got half a second left on the shot clock. Inbound to Jonas. I don't know if he got it all. No, he did. And I'm the king of playthrough, but that's a lot. That's a lot. Call it both ways. Somebody's got to pick up a technical foul. I, I was thinking about this all day. They're going to let Golden State just bang us around, no whistle. Because they did exactly the same thing to Portland last night. Thompson, top of the key. Line drive, no. Long rebound to Murphy. I mean, they're shooting 35%. We can't take advantage. Trey, left baseline, underneath the hoop. Tiptoes the baseline, now back out long to Dyson Daniels. Now floated down low, Jonas, bumped by Looney. Still bump, throws up a wild hook that drops in despite all the contact. Huh? You got to play through it. So Thompson catch and shoot left wing three. He's done that about a million times in his career. Oh, look at that. How, <laughs> how smooth and quick that was for them. And the Pels are laboring the score. Dyson right corner three, online and down. There you go. You drive and kick. You can get an open look. Daniels two of four last night in Sacramento from distance. 31-24. Can just hang around. Dyson, Dyson shooting 43% yeah. from yeah. three since he came back in the seven games. Now Paul whip it out to Thompson. Good close out Daniels. And then a double clutch mid-range. No rebound JV. Good defense by Daniels. Outlet to Alvarado. Jose, front court. Guarded by Thompson. Get it to McCollum. Straight away three. He is way, way off. Long rebound to Daniels, though. McCollum can't buy a bucket. Murphy. Crosses over, double team, hook it to Jonas, pick and pop, left wing three. Barely, barely got the front iron. This is a peach basket game for the Pels offensively. Paul drives in, high off the glass and in. Dyson Daniels got screened by Kavon Looney and ended up on the floor. Well, it's extremely physical, and look, you better match it if you're the Pelicans. Dyson hard to the rim, floats it up over the side iron and good. As Daniels and Moody ended up on the deck, did they call a foul? I couldn't hear a whistle. They called a foul, and I got to tell you, I don't even know if Moody fouled him, to be honest with you. He was on the trail, and I don't know if he got his body. Wow. Well, of course, if you're the Pelicans and me, you'll take it. But <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not sure that Moody fouled him. Don't think he did. So despite... <laughs> Despite shooting 34% and 2 of 11 from 3, the Pels are only down 6. 8.54 to go in the second quarter. So Dyson, with the N1, is good. So he's got 6. Valanchunas has 10, and that's it. Nobody else is doing anything. Valanchunas has got the quietest 10 I've seen in a long time. Paul? Short corner left, weaves through to oh, the dotted right, line. Yeah, he's where he wants to be. Whoa, down to the goal goal Yeah. When Chris Paul is able to get both feet into the paint, he is exactly where he wants to be. Either he's going to shoot that mid-range or he's going to find a teammate. Looney kind of released. Dyson Daniels released Looney and 
That allowed him to get free for the layup, which was a goal 10 by Valanchunas. Herb Jones back into the game. This is Iffy here with two fouls now. Jonas backing down Looney to the block. Doubled. Threw it out. Stolen by Chris Paul. Up the floor, Pajemski. Whip it back to Paul on the Chase Center logo right wing. Splits through the Looney. Double team. Back to Looney for the pop. He'll take a 10-footer. That's a brick. And the rebound, C.J. McCollum. Oh, that isn't Looney shot. So you got the right guy taking that shot if you're the Pell. Pells have been swimming upstream since the opening tip. Down eight here with 7.50 to go in the second. McCollum to Daniels. Extra pass Herb. What's a long two? And he hit it. Herb, you got to step back, man. You could see it from up here. The way the Pells are playing, I'll take that too. Yeah. Herb, Anything. Herb whacked himself in the top of the head, backpedaling into the front court now for the Warriors. As again, Steve Kerr just doesn't like those long jumpers and takes another timeout. Well, he's doing everything he can to make sure that the Pels don't have anything to build on. It's really unbelievable. We're down six here. 35 29, 741 to go in the half. Gus Cattengill with a scoreboard update when we come back on the Pelicans Radio Network. Entergy works for the moments you live for. The joy, Touchdown! the heart, Here's your boy. the wonder, and if we do this, our robot should. Oh, At Entergy, we're dedicated to powering each moment, today and for future generations. We're leading the way with a cleaner, more reliable grid to power every day, because these moments matter. Your graduating class. We power life. Entergy. Chevron with Tecron has unbeatable engine cleaning power, and it gives you unbeatable mileage for all kinds of unbeatable destinations, like time in the sun at the beach, or time in the sun riding roller coasters, or a day in the sun hiking mountains. Well, probably just one mountain would be enough for a day, but hiking a mountain is still an unbeatable choice for how to spend time. Download the Chevron app now to get unbeatable mileage at locations near you. Mid-City Smiles is proud to be the official dental care provider of the New Orleans Pelicans. Located in the heart of New Orleans, Mid-City Smiles specializes in family dentistry, dental implants, cosmetic procedures, and is recognized as the leading area provider of Invisalign. Dr. Mark Anderson and his team invite you to visit their state-of-the-art office and become part of the Mid-City Smiles family. Call 485-6575 or visit midcitysmiles.com today. We create winning smiles. Here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude Perfect smoothie with Smoothie King. Uh, we is strong. It's my recipe. Technically, we all came up with it, Kobe. I mean, you put a potato in yours. I was experimenting. Yeah, we picked up on that. Guys, this is fruit smoothie perfection. I even heard it recently quoted that it was food perfect. <laughs> yeah, I was on the set. Oh, that was, was funny. Oh, honey. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, get the Dude Perfect smoothie only at Smoothie King. My smoothie. Welcome back to Pelicans Basketball. Let's check tonight's NBA scoreboard. Well, the Lakers do wind up getting the win over the Grizzlies, 123 to 120. T Wolves win by three as well. The Thunder, 125 107. The game we're keeping an eye on. It's an offensive output. 7 11 in the first quarter. Suns, eight. Kings, four. Graf and JD back to y'all. All right, thanks, Gus. Here, 741 left in a sluggish first half, really, for both teams. Golden State's got a 35 29 lead. But this is just a fist fight. And the Pels, fortunately, are still in this game as poorly as they're shooting and playing. Wiggins, Curry, Jackson Davis, Green, and Paul for the dubs. Oh, and Zion just stripped Andrew Wiggins. Zion into the game. Bounce feed to Herb Jones. He'll take it to the rack. That's got to be a goal 10, huh? That's Follow foul on Curry. Curry. But it looked like it might have been a goal 10. Somebody. Like, like it was they, over the front of the rim. I agree. Andrew Wiggins trailed. I, I couldn't tell from there. I thought he got a hand on it, but. All right, now Curry fouled him. Let's see. Yeah, we don't they see shut the replay. the replay down just and at the moment yeah, of truth. And Ben Pell's yeah. free throw, no good. Yeah, Pell's coach, coach's coaching staff didn't feel good enough about it to challenge, so. Yeah, Ed, oh, Flynn our, free throws. Ed Flynn, our challenge man. One of two for Jones. 35-30, Golden State, 725 left. 
in the second quarter. To Davis, one-on-one with Z, hands it off to Curry. Curry, trail by Alvarado, high, floater off the heel, no, rebound Z, good defense. Outlet to McCollum. CJ, stop, pop, right wing three. Get in there. Uh, rinse one. Yes. Come on, Christian James. Nine made threes last night. He's inching towards the franchise record. He's Absolutely. only three away. Absolutely. He's closing in. No, oh, that was stripping a steal. Zion just fronted Curry, and there goes Herb with a two-hand flush. Defense to offense. Stick with it. You can play poorly, but if you defend, you'll give yourself a chance at some point. Page of Stoyakovich's record is 231. Right now, McCollum sitting at 228. Backdoor cut, Curry, fall away 10-footer. No. Rebound McCollum. We're tied at 35 with 6.30 to go in the half. McCollum, crossover to Jose, back to CJ. CJ between circles, chess it to Z. Draymond Green's going to back off of him. Back up top, McCollum, pop a three. Two in a row for Christian James. Come on, President. <laughs> the President takes the pass from Zion Williamson because all eyes are on Z and Z makes the correct play. Now you, all you got to do is make him right. 11-0 run by the Pell. And Steve Kerr doing his best Mike Brown imitation, taking all the timeouts early in this game. 6-18 left in the half and the Pells finally got it cooking a little bit offensively. Lead at 38-35 in the Pelicans Radio Network. Hey, this is Brian Geltzer from NBA Weekend. We had ESPN's Evan Cohen on with us, and he said he thinks Damian Lillard won't be in Milwaukee for very long. I don't think they're saying you have to get out of here. I think it's literally a human professional sit-down. I don't think he's out. out. This doesn't work out. I think it's a mutual one and done for Damian Lillard in Milwaukee. As crazy as that may sound. The best guest joined me and Sam Mitchell every Saturday morning 7 to 10 a.m. Eastern Time on NBA Radio Channel 86 and on the all-new Sirius XM app. The greatest guitarist is Eddie Van Halen. What about Prince? You have to include Slash and Jimmy Page. B.B. King and Bonnie Raitt. The Edge changed everything. The debate continues with rebellious riffs and six-string solos on the Sirius XM Guitar Greats channel. All hail International Guitar Month. Sirius XM Guitar Grades on Channel 107 and year-round on the Sirius XM app. Get closer to everything that moves you, wherever you are. They are among the greatest to ever play their sports. Caitlin Clark is the all-time scoring leader. They are legends and icons. Holly Bird hit the shot with no second spot. I don't know how he did it. And you can hear them right now on the all-new Sirius XM app. We are here with Iowa superstar Caitlin Clark. I'm so focused on winning. It's never anything I ever take for granted. Here comes Larry Bird, the Hall of Famer, and he just won Legend of the Year. Legend of the Year, isn't that something? For access to the game's greats, we lie on the leader in sports audio. Sirius XM and the Sirius XM app. Hey, this is Brian Geltzer. Wake up early with me in 2007 NBA coaching year. Sam Mitchell every Saturday morning from 7 to 10 a.m. Eastern as we break down everything NBA on Channel 86. He's kicked up the base. Seeky got him a great deal on seats right near the action. So when he yells, what are you doing? Look at him. He'd be absolutely sure the players heard him. Seeky handles the tickets to sports, concerts, and more. So fans can fan. Parker McCollum. Burn It Down Tour 2024. April 11th. Smoothie King Center. ACM Best New Artist. Parker McCollum Live with special guest Corey Kent. Finally got a handle on you. What in the hell does a man on sale now at Ticketmaster.com. Parker McCollum has led this game with 11.08 in the first quarter. Curry off the curl, one dribble, straightaway three. And the all-time leading three-point king just made his 352nd three-pointer of the season. See, Jose comes over the top of that screen, but he's got to chase him off the line. We're tied at 38. Zion left elbow guarded by Draymond. Powers up, floats it up, no, back tapped out. Zion wanted another foul, didn't get it. He's going to pick up a technical foul. He's got to just play. Saw that? Draymond Green and Zion Williamson were hand fighting into the front court, and guess who gets the foul? It's Z. Zion Williamson. And Draymond going, hey, man, I didn't do nothing. Zion is getting Draymond right now. Yeah. he's getting. He is getting a first-hand foul. And Willie Green does a wise thing. He does a wise thing. He switches defensive assignments. Trey Murphy 
guarding Draymond. First foul on Zion. Pajemski between circles. Chess it to Curry. Fly by Murphy. Picked up his dribble. Floats it up. Denied by her. That's why you chase him off the line. Up the floor. Alvarado passed up the three. Trey will pass up a three as he made that one from Stockton. Right wing deep and down. Tells warming to the occasion, which we thought they would. We hoped they would. As Green nearly threw it away, but it's run down by Thompson on the right hash mark. Pell's up 41-38. Steal. Oh, go, 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 go. Pop straight away. Three. Good. Go, After go, the go, go, go. Now one away from the single season record for C.J. McCollum. I mean, he couldn't make anything to start the game. He's made three straight. It's a heat check. Now Thompson to Wiggins. Right corner three. That's a brick. Long rebound, Trey Murphy. They're going to keep shooting threes, folks. You just got to hope they miss them. McCollum, oh, he was trying to tie the record right there, and they closed out on him. Backs it out near the timeline. Steph Curry's going to guard C.J. Right-hand dribble drive to the paint. Kick it to Jose. The catch and shoot. High three. Happy birthday, Jose. He did that last night where he just caught it and shot it. He ran it down in the corner, and this one was a high catch. 9-0 run for the Pels. And just like that, New Orleans leads 47-38. to Pajemski goes back door in a worse layup in the left hand. Great pass by Curry. He's standing in the right corner, and you think he's staying there to be stationary to take a three, but he cut back door. Now Murphy, stop, pop, right wing. Three again! I mean, these are from the Bay. Heater. And these were guys who could not buy a three in the first quarter. It is contagious. 50 to 40. Curry backdoor cut. Oh, we had a steal, and Zion was off to the races and dribbled it off of his foot. Pills but up. now we're getting active defensively Pills here. Pills up to 8 of 17 from yeah. three. Remember, 22 threes last night. And after a very slow start. And you're going to have to make some threes to beat this No team. doubt. No doubt. Up 10 here, 340 to go in the half. Pajemski trying to get it down low. Cannot. Hounded by Jose. Now low post right. Draymond backdoor cut. Curry lays it in. They've been doing that. Uh, but you got to guard it. you got to make Draymond Green into a score. He's posted up, but he's not looking to score. So Green, move to your man. Green has not scored. Now McCollum, they left him alone to tie the record, and he hits it right wing. Good. Christian James McCollum, folks. 231 threes in this season. Wiggins has a deep strip by C.J. out of bounds, it's and off. it's going to be Pelican's ball. Yeah, it's off his foot. C.J. up to 14 points, and I can't remember him having a slower start and then turning it on. He's got four threes all in the second quarter. Now Zion back to McCollum. One more, and he sets the franchise record for threes in a season. Trey drives in. Oh, he that's was going up. Yeah, that's off his way. Oh, he was going up with bad intentions, and that passed. Pajemski stripped <laughs> it on the way up. That's a really good defensive play because he had an open path to the rim. Hell's up 53-42 with 2.50 to go in the half. Curry crosses over it. Strip taken by McCollum. Murphy got his hand in there. So turnover number nine now for the Dubs. CJ, top of the key to Herb, and now we'll back it out. Now Zion, 101 with Wiggins, floats it up left hand, didn't get the roll. He's not going to get the call. Get back on defense. You're not going to get that call. Pajemski into the front court to Wiggins. It's been a frustrating night for Z. I mean, really frustrating. He's two for 10. Wiggins, 101 with Jose, spins left. Stripped by Alvarado, but a foul, and he knows it. Well, Zion's got a. I understand. That's his game, and he's drawing contact. But the continuous complaining to the officials, you're not going to get the call sooner or later. Well, he's complaining. You've got to gripe your way into a, a take. Right now he was complaining to his teammates. Yeah. But, look, it's like I said, it's not going to change. Yeah, it is what it, it is. It is not going yeah. to change. It is what it is, and you just got to play ball. I just really like to see him dunk the ball instead of – well, now well, some can't. of these he can't. Yeah, he can't. Some of these he yeah, can't. He's getting hacked, so he can't. Wiggins free throw is good. He is now 5-5 five for five as we're over the limit. Actually, check that. We only have two, but there's 2.17 left in the second quarter. Pels, I mean, you talk about a turnaround from outside. We literally could not make a shot. No. <laughs> no. Looked like they had left them all – in Sacramento. Second free throw long rebound Murphy. His sixth rebound already. 
Hell's up 10, 2-10 to go in the half. Z, Green's parked at the free throw line. Williamson to McCollum. CJ, hounded by Wiggins, going to back it out to the center circle logo. Now Pajemski on the switch. Pull up right wing three, short. Rebound Murphy. And Curry just took it away from him with more contact. And then Zion just picked Curry's pocket. Back-to-back -back steals. Yeah, you just got to turn it around on him. That's all you got to flip it. All right, Z, there's Green in a catcher's stance to Murphy. Murphy drives to the nail, back to Z, leave it for McCollum. Fly by Pajemski. No shot, though. Out long Murphy. Shot clock at five. Oh, my Deep goodness. three. Oh, my goodness. No go. Oh, my goodness. That was from Oakland. That was from across the bay. Whoa. A shot he can make. And then they throw it away. Draymond Green thought he was going to get a backdoor cut, and nobody cut. 119 left. The Pels now are 10 of 20 from distance. Can you believe that? Hey, they flipped the switch. <laughs> they flipped the switch. They're at 39 points in this quarter. Williamson to Murphy, right at the top. Well, they left him alone. Yeah, he should have shot he it. Didn't shoot. He should have shot it. Shot clock at five now. McCollum picked up by Pajemski. CJ through the legs twice. He's going to step back three left wing for the record. There it is. Number 232 for Christian James McCollum this season. Smoke him if you got him, CJ. Five threes in the corner for McCollum. And he didn't even have him, and he smoked him anyway. Now Curry lost it out yeah, of bounds. Curry. Oh, Herb wants a challenge. Yeah, that, I think that's off Curry. You notice how much our defensive intensity has changed it here has in the quarter? skyrocketed, and, and there is going to be a challenge. So Ed Flynn said challenges, Coach. And we will. What an unbelievable quarter here in San Francisco for New Orleans. It ain't how you start. Uh-oh. <laughs> Clay Thompson. Who is he? He's talking at our bench. Is he trying to fire up his bench? He's doing the best. His best Draymond Green. Well, I mean, we know, we know Clay is famous for throwing up the four fingers to let you know how many championships he's got. New Orleans Bill. ball. It's being challenged by Golden State. What in the oh, world so they called it Pills ball and, and uh, Golden State's up okay. for the challenge. Hills have 10 threes in the quarter. And 11 overall, which tells you how we shot in the first quarter. And remember, the first quarter, the only guy who made a three was Jeremiah Robinson Earl. <laughs> I made I mean, the first one. <laughs> nobody could make a shot. And JRE pops the three. And uh, now, I mean, if you didn't watch the game last night, folks, you're watching what happened in Sacramento last yeah, night. This is exactly the way the Pels shot the ball. 42 points in this second quarter and this is exactly the way they, they shot the ball last night let's see as we see the replay it's off step it oh, looks yeah. like it's off step no herb herb's right hand isn't even near the ball yeah that looks like it's off step curry and it looks like golden state's gonna now, waste the challenge they really challenge that yeah they, no, they no, no 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 we challenged it it's a pelicans challenge oh i i, I thought the official said that golden state challenge maybe just misspoke all right, by the way, the Pelicans have 999 threes as a team, which I don't – Look, we, uh, we've seen this team shoot threes and not shoot them well at all. After replay review, the challenge is successful. It will be overturned to New Orleans' ball. New Orleans will get their timeout back, and they will retain their challenge. Thank you, David Guthrie. I'm not exactly sure what Clay Thompson was griping about. I, I don't either. I think he's just trying to fire up his team. The problem was nobody was with him. Yeah, I mean, well, he was pointing at our bench. That's usually Draymond's job. I, now, I'm trying to see. Thompson. Thompson's walking by our bench. See if you can see what set him off. I don't uh, know. Yeah. I mean, Jose's on the floor, so anything <laughs> can happen. <laughs> All right. Zion's going to bring it into the front court. Zion's going to dribble with a right hand to the paint. Bumped by Green twice. Spins. Lost it out of bounds. Yep, just lost it. He's doing too much. He's doing too much. The frustration is getting to him, and he's doing too much. Yeah, you you got to be patient. All right, 59-43. Shot clock, game clock, seven seconds apart. Chris Paul right in the center circle. Get it to Curry. Curry straddling the yard, got free. Z blitzed him, but then Curry got free and will rinse a three ball straight away. Yeah, Z gambles, misses the steal, and Steph Curry turns around for a wide open three. Didn't need to gamble. All right, shot clock off. Williamson front court left. 
Hounded by Chris Paul. Whip it to Alvarado. We got a foul. They had one to give. Chris Paul fouled Williamson with 4.8 to go. And Z said, now you call a foul? <laughs> it's still an unbelievable quarter, but that three kind of takes some of the sting out of it by Curry. Now, you can answer here. 42 to 20 quarter for the Pels. Hey, when they turn it, they turn it. And they turned it. All right, Herb left side. Inbound to Z. Z drives into the paint, floats it up, and one over Draymond Green, who contacted him chest to chest. My friend, ask and ye shall receive. You wanted a three-pointer in this quarter. Not a three-point jumper, but we'll take the traditional three. Again, you look at the replay. That's nothing compared to what we've seen. Yeah, that, that, I don't even... I don't even think that's a foul. I don't think that was a foul. That's a them problem. <laughs> so Williamson, despite maybe the most frustrating half of basketball he's had in months, I mean months, he's 3 of 11 from the field. Well, you know, he's gotten his teammates to ride to his rescue in this one. C.J. McCollum oh, and Trey Murphy. 17 first-half points for McCollum, who is now the single-season record holder in threes made in the New Orleans franchise. Free throw Z is good. Now, don't give him anything cheap. Baseball pass down to Paul, get it to Curry, and we give up something cheap. That's just... It's, that's disgusting. You saw that coming. Now, Jeremiah Robinson Earl checked in. He went down like he was going to guard Chris Paul. He didn't. They put Jose Alvarado on Chris Paul. Chris Paul screens him out. They hit the baseball pass. And Steph Curry on the release for the layup, and that's just poor. With 2.4 seconds left, they get a cheap bucket out of it. So the last five points that the Warriors scored kind of leaves a bad taste in your mouth, but how can you argue with the offensive output by New Orleans? And you'll take a 62-48 lead into the halftime break here in San Francisco. Yeah, probably the best second quarter the Pelicans have played this season, if not the best one of the best, and considering the circumstances, right up there at the top because they need this game, and they're on the road against a formidable opponent. All right, we'll take a break. Come back. Pelicans at the half. Gus Kattengill, Jim Eichenhofer will join you. Pels up 62-48 in San Francisco. We'll head back to New Orleans. We come back on the Pelicans Radio Network. This season, there's going to be a new name on the court around here because good doesn't cut it. Rates, not enough. Let's be extraordinary. Keesler Federal Credit Union, the official credit union of the New Orleans Pelicans. Be extraordinary. Federally insured by NCUA. Membership eligibility required. My personal favorite stories are when a young man comes in and you can see they're a little intimidated. This just happened last week. I saw the young man. I said, hey, what can I do to give you a hand? And he said, well, I'm here for an engagement ring, but I don't think I'm in the right place. So I got him to my desk and within an hour, he had purchased an engagement ring had spent a thousand dollars and he was treated like he spent a lot more and i'm sure we have a customer for life my name is ken friend of friend and company fine jewelers you've got a friend in the jewelry business maxwell in concert the serenade tour saturday october 19th at smoothie king center maxwell with special guest Jasmine Sullivan and October London. Tickets on sale now at Ticketmaster.com. Don't miss Maxwell Live. SeatGeek's the ticketing app for fans like the sideline shot caller. Come on, boys, pick up the pace. SeatGeek got him a great deal on seats right near the action, so when he yells, What are you doing? Block him! He can be absolutely sure the players heard him. SeatGeek handles the tickets to sports, concerts, and more, so fans can fan. This season, there's going to be a new name on the court around here, because good doesn't cut it. Rates, not enough. Let's be extraordinary. Keesler Federal Credit Union, the official credit union of the New Orleans Pelicans. Be extraordinary. Federally insured by NCUA. Membership eligibility required. Time now for Pelicans at the Half. Scores, highlights, stats, and more. Here's your host, Gus Kattengau. 
outlong Murphy. Shot clock at five. Oh, my Deep goodness. three. Oh, my goodness. Go, go. Oh, my goodness. That was from Oakland. That was from across the bay. What a second quarter by the Pelicans. A 45-22 second. Give New Orleans a 62-48 lead. Gus Cottingill, Jamaica, and off with you amongst friends. Uh, I will just say this. It... Oh, it, it changed what happened in the second quarter, Jim Eikenhoff. Yeah, I mean, that was one of the best examples I've ever seen of a team not making shots, not making layups in the first quarter. And then in the second quarter, it was a completely different performance. I mean, the way that CJ and Trey shot in the second quarter, how much fun was that? Just the just constantly from way past the three-point line. You don't see two guys doing heat checks in the same stretch of, of a game very often, but it felt like that was what it was, was those two, two guys just going back and forth, draining threes. Uh, obviously, Trey Murphy getting going, but CJ McCollum continuing that three-point barrage as well. Zion finding a little space. Antonio Daniels was mentioning there's something that Steve Kerr is trying to do with him to kind of take him out of rhythm. What is that? Yeah, I mean, it, it seems like they're definitely packing the paint like everyone has done. It seemed like he, he was just losing the ball a lot. I mean, some of that, of course, was the defense, but I mean, to me, that's another good sign that Zion really did not have a good first half at all. You played really pretty bad the first five minutes of the game, especially finishing around the rim, and you're still up by 14 at halftime. So, I mean, to be able to go through some of the stuff that they did at the beginning of the game and be up double figures, I mean, that bodes really well. I think you could definitely tell having played the night before, I think both teams are missing shots that you normally would see going in. I feel like this second half, it's going to be a testament of wills. We're going to get to that here in a quick sec because the third quarter is something the Golden State Warriors have been known to be a team about, if that makes any sense. Yeah. We'll take a look at the NBA scoreboard and then we'll get you ready for second half action. But you got to like where we are 62 48 Pelicans with the lead in Golden State. You're listening to Pelicans OT on the Pelicans Radio Network. Here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude Perfect smoothie with Smoothie King. Uh, we is strong. It's my recipe. Technically, we all came up with it, Kobe. I mean, you put a potato in yours. I was experimenting. Yeah, we picked up on that. Guys, this is fruit smoothie perfection. I even heard it recently quoted that it was food perfect. <laughs> yeah, I was on the said that. Oh, it was, it was funny. Oh, honey. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, get the Dude Perfect smoothie only at Smoothie King. My smoothie. This is old number eight, Archie Manning. Join me at Manning Sports Bar and Grill with award-winning burgers, 24 beers on tap, craft cocktails, 13-foot mega screens, 30 flat screen TVs, plus recliners. Manning Sports Bar and Grill is where you'll catch me watching the games. Ready to be a legend of your own game? Head on over to Harris for 24-7 action-packed gaming, where the tables are hot, the dice are fast, and the slots are generous. Remember, you can't win if you don't play. See you soon. Must be 21 or older to enter casino and gamble. No one to stop before you start. Gambling problem? Call 1-877-770-STOP. Hey, basketball fans. Ready to score some cash back? Tip off your shopping trips with the Ibotta app or browser extension and get cash back on groceries and more. Start with Ibotta to find offers at hundreds of your favorite retailers from groceries and home improvement to sporting goods and apparel. Then shop as usual in-store or online. The average saver earns over $100 per year. Download the free app or browser extension and start earning cash back today. Ibotta. Cash back made easy. Ibotta is a proud sponsor of the New Orleans Pelicans. CCI Productions is an XL printing, design, fabrication, and installation, and finishing company known for their accuracy and precision in branding spaces and events. Let their team of graphic solutions specialists provide you with professional consultation, creative conceptualization, high quality production, and expert execution. Learn more today at CCIproductions.io. CCI, official partner of the New Orleans Saints. Outlet to McCollum. CJ, stop, pop, right wing three. Get in there. Uh, rinse one. Yes. Come on, Christian James. Nine made threes last night. He's inching towards the franchise record. He's Absolutely. only three away. Absolutely. He's closing in. No, oh, that was stripping a steal. Zion just fronted Curry, and there goes Herb with a two-hand flush. Defense to offense. Stick with it. That has been a theme in all of these games so far on the road. Pelicans lead is 62 to 48. Elsewhere, 
We are scoreboard watching second quarter, 10 minutes and 10 seconds left. The Kings 31, the Suns 24. Eichenhofer, is that good? That's very good, Gus. Keep it up, Sacramento. All right, I love that. The Lakers 123, the Grizzlies 120. Is that good? That's not good. That is not good. I don't know where to go. For We're that. hoping that they would lose, yeah. and um, if they were in the 10 spot, they wouldn't have anything to play for You know Sunday. what? I keep maybe saying we'll... this. I was saying this to the graph earlier, and he was like, who cares? Victor win Miami 34 points. The Spurs beat the Nuggets 121-120. That is a massive loss because yeah. the Nuggets had a one-game lead on the T-Wolves and Thunder. And the T-Wolves are back in first now. And the Thunder, mm -hmm. are one. they won over the Bucks. And the T-Wolves won. So guess where we are now? Three that is time. a massive, massive win. I'm telling you, that's why people love Pop. That's why people see what Will Mayama can do there. That was a game that Denver thought they could have won. They wound up losing that. In San Francisco, though, the Pelicans have the lead, 62-48. to Eichenhofer's second-half keys. We come back on the Pelicans Radio Network. Pels fans, did you know the best burger in New Orleans is actually in Metairie? Atomic Burger has become a fan favorite thanks to big, exciting flavors. People love their bacon jam burger, their Nashville hot chicken sandwich, and their Nutella marshmallow shake. Plus, they do everything right. They grind their beef in-house every day, hand cut their fries, and they won't start cooking until you place your order. Started right here in Louisiana, Atomic Burger has locations in Metairie, Baton Rouge, and Prairieville. Check them out. AmeriHealth Caritas Louisiana helps people get care, stay well, and build healthy communities. Our Medicaid plan offers a wide range of benefits to best meet your health needs and those of your family. Care is the heart of our work. And just like the Saints, our team is committed to excellence. Make AmeriHealth Caritas Louisiana your choice today. Learn more about the benefits of our Medicaid health plan by visiting careforla.com. That's careforla.com. Hi, this is Quentin. And this is Brianna. A little thing we love about Chick-fil-A chicken strips are how satisfying they are. The chicken strips are amazing. They're always filling, tender and juicy. Definitely one of my favorite things on the menu. My favorite thing is the last bite. The last bite is nice and juicy, and it's wrapped up in some crispy breading that keeps it nice and tasty. And being able to scoop up my Chick-fil-A sauce with it, it's just like the best part of the meal. It's an undefeated combo. Order the chicken strips on the Chick-fil-A app today. Real customers paid for their testimonials. Let's go. You ready, hotties? She's coming. Megan the Stallion. Hot Girl Summer Tour. Live in New Orleans. Smoothie King Center, June 10th. With special guest, Glorilla. Get tickets now at Ticketmaster.com. Megan the Stallion. Hot Girl Summer Tour. For more, hit up MeganTheStallion.com. Chevron with Tecron has unbeatable engine cleaning power and it gives you unbeatable mileage for all kinds of unbeatable destinations like time in the sun at the beach or time in the sun riding roller coasters or a day in the sun hiking mountains. Well, probably just one mountain would be enough for a day, but hiking a mountain is still an unbeatable choice for how to spend time. Download the Chevron app now to get unbeatable mileage at locations near you. Head coach Willie Green playing this one like a playoff game. 62 to 48 will explain in Pelicans OT. Second half action where we come back. John the Shades or Tiger Fanini on the Pelicans Radio Network. Feel the energy. Blast loud by. And the impact of Sirius XL Octane. Immerse yourself in a community of hard rock extremists. <laughs> World premieres, live performances, and artist takeovers. A giant thank you to the entire Octane community for keeping rock alive. Turn up new hard rock. Turn up Octane. Tonight, channel 37 and on the Sirius XM app. The biggest clubs in world soccer clash at the UEFA Champions League. And it's on Sirius XM FC. What a brilliant finish that is for Mavinia. After a thrilling 3-2 win in Paris, Barcelona hosts PSG in the second leg of the quarterfinals with a spot in the last four on the line. Breaks the Dembele. Jack foot it right into the back of the net. Barcelona versus PSG Tuesday at 3 Eastern on Sirius XM FC 157 and streaming on the Sirius XM app. 
The biggest names in the NBA all stop by the starting lineup. The legend had a storm. By the way, I'm super excited to be on your show. I listen to you guys all the time. So be honest. Being Frank on this show is exactly how he is in real life, because a lot of people ask me that question. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I tell them that. I say that's exactly how he is. It's not a bit. Hear more great guests on the starting lineup every weekday morning from 7 to 10 a.m. Eastern on Sirius XM NBA Radio, Channel 86 in the car, and on the all-new Sirius XM app. Netflix is a joke radio. Brings you exclusive comedy specials and stand-up from Netflix's massive library from the world's biggest comedians. He's Mick Jagger. I pitched him a joke and he went, no. Funny. We give you unparalleled access to Netflix's top premieres. And join Tom, Papa, and Fortune Finster every day for interviews with the biggest names in comedy. <laughs> Netflix is a joke radio, Channel 93. Search comedy on the all-new SiriusXM app. The 2024 NFL Draft is fast approaching, and Sirius XM NFL Radio is getting you ready with our series of draft previews. Marvin Harrison's third TD catch of the game. Get expert insight and analysis from our staff of former players, coaches, and executives. He may be the best receiver prospect I've seen for the last five years. Sirius XM NFL Radio's 2024 NFL Draft Preview, Offensive Players Edition. Get it anytime on the all-new Sirius XM app. On the court, off the court, and on devices equipped with Amazon Alexa. For the best basketball insight, just say, Alexa, listen to NBA Radio on Sirius XM. Okay, like time in the sun at the beach, or time in the sun riding roller coasters, or a day in the sun hiking mountains. Well, probably just one mountain would be enough for a day, but hiking a mountain is still an unbeatable choice for how to spend time. Download the Chevron app now to get unbeatable mileage at locations near you. Todd Graffinini, John DeShazer with you here at Chase Center, San Francisco, California, where the Pelicans could not have shot the ball worse to start this ball game. And then as the second quarter began, the light switch flicked on, and the Pelicans scored 45 points in the second quarter, hit 10 threes, and it was fun to watch. Well, second quarter only, and I'll give you this because Golden State did not play bad in that quarter. Nine and seventeen from the field, three of four from three. But the Pelicans made ten threes and shot seventy percent from the field, and forced eight turnovers for fifteen points. Scored off those turnovers, and that is a huge deal when you're on the road and you're scuffling offensively when you get those turnovers and see a couple shots fall and the floodgates open for you. Now, the Lakers already beat Memphis tonight, so they are now ahead of Golden State as far as trying to host a play-in game. So the Warriors are going to play desperate here in the second half. You've got to match their energy. We had a shooting quarter like this last year in this building, and in the third quarter, it completely flipped. And we wound up losing by 20. Clay Thompson at the nail, follow-away jumper. Of course. Yeah. And it's 62-50. But he makes a fairly tough, too. You chase them off the three-point line, and you take your chances. First five minutes are everything. I mean everything. You're going to let them back into it, or you're going to keep the pedal down? McCollum. He's got five made threes in this game. Get it to Valanchunas. Low post left. Driving on Jackson Davis, and he misses the runner. Rebound green. There they go. Book pass dunk. And can we call timeout and start the quarter again? Yeah, you got a rim run. And Jonas Valanciunas is right on his heels, but he doesn't get in front of him after he misses that shot. I'm telling you, first five minutes, Williamson center of the lane, switches, spins, floats it up, got the roll with the left hand. And you know they're going to make a push, so you got to do the things to keep them at bay. You got to make shots. That's what keeps him out of the fast break. Curry behind the back to Jackson Davis, reverse layup. I mean, that's nifty. Jackson Davis, I mean, his shooting percentage, sky high. McCollum left angle three says, shooting percentage this, Golden State. I'll just knock another one down from this. Look, when Christian James is playing this way, the Pels are a difficult team. No doubt. 20 points for CJ already. Six of nine from distance. He had nine last night in Sacramento. And he was awful in the first quarter. Wiggins. Bump. Strip. Z. One on two. Can he get to the rim? Nope. 
Missed the layup. Thompson was not going to give him the dunk, though. You could see the foul coming. Clay Thompson was saying, you know what? You got to make two free throws. I'm not going to give you the layup. But great defense by Z to dig it out from Andrew Wiggins. So Williamson, again, it was a rough shooting half for him. Four of 12 in the first half. And he missed Zion Williamson's shot. Oh, no doubt. Free throw, no chance. So, good foul by Clay Thompson. Willie Green's looking at the clock. We got a long way to go, Coach. Yeah, long. <laughs> don't, e don't even look long, up. Long. Don't even look a up. Long way. 10 09, third quarter. I mean, nowhere near. Yeah, I mean, they weren't both, both front irons. So now they're going to keep fouling him. That's what that is going to happen. Curry off the curl, step back, sets his feet, three ball, brick. Rebound, deflected and taken by Herb. You got a break right there. He set his feet for well, three. JV left him. He left him. You got to stay out oh, there. right hand, dribble drive. Zion switches back to the lefty and finger rolls it in over the front iron. And Jonas Valanciunas atones because he set the screen that allowed Z to get to the front of the rim. So Williamson now with 11 points in the Pels lead 69 Oh, so he got 54. lost offensively. Yep. Backdoor cut Wiggins, and he lays it in. He got lost defensively, and you can't have that. McCollum crosses over, drives in, throws it to Murphy. That's he got foul. held by Draymond Green. I'll take that. That's three on Green. Now, again, Murphy was going to go in for a dunk, so, I mean, Draymond took it took it for the team right there, but that's a pretty cheap foul to give. Because Draymond's been on Zion all night. Well, Draymond's gotten away with a couple of harder fouls than that, so... Yeah, but that one he owns up to because Trey had him pump faked. Four of the five in double figures for the Pels. Four of the five starters. Herb Jones has five. Everybody else in double figures. Williamson, bumped by Green, hook pass to Herb. Right wing three. That is not close. Got to get Herb back on track. Yeah, he has struggled from three in the last three weeks. Curry, bumped by Herb, floats it up and oh, missed it. But Herb with the cheap foul. So free throws coming up for Curry. If Herb could just stay away from the cheap ones. Yep. He bit on the head fake. And, I mean, look, you bite on the head fake at the three-point line. You've kind of done your job because you want to chase him off the three-point line. That is your goal against Steph Curry. You'll settle for the twos, especially when you're up 13. Curry with three threes tonight, 353 on the season. The all-time record is set by Curry. You had 405 in a year. That's that's ridiculous. And Steph Curry's got 52 games of at least four threes this season. And he and McCollum are actually two of the top three and threes made per game. Curry's at five and McCollum's at three and a half. 69-58. You were just up by 15, so 4-0 run. McCollum splits through, gets to Jonas, and blows the layup. Jonas got to get it going. Yes, he does. He ran it exactly to perfection. Curry bounced me to Jackson. Davis blocked from behind by Herb Jones. Out of bounds, baseline left. That's a great recovery and help defense by Herb Jones. And this is why he's one of the top defenders in the league. 13 on the shot clock. And he's got to make that play because Jonas Valanciunas cannot leave Steph Curry. All right, Curry baseline left, bounce feed to Wiggins, and all the work he just did is for naught because you get a layup off the inbound. Well, Clay Thompson set the screen, and Z didn't get over it or under it, and you got you can't allow a layup off the inbound. Now Williamson picked up by Draymond, hard to the rack. That's a goal 10 on Trace Jackson Davis. You can yell all you want. That thing was going in, too. So Williamson's starting to feel it a little bit now. As he just went right by Draymond Green. It's tough to keep. Well, they hadn't kept him out. He just hadn't made the shot. Right. So Williamson all of a sudden with 13 points. 71-60 Pelicans. Jackson Davis. Get it to Draymond Green. Left hash mark. Looking for a cutter. That's what they do. Whip it to Wiggins. Wiggins put on the arc. Spins left. Lays it in. Right past Williamson. No defense right now for the Pels. Up the floor, McCullum. Stop, pop, right wing three. Fun iron. Rebound, Curry. There they go again. Pels up nine. 
You get back in transition. Curry, no look over to Wiggins, puts his shoulder down, spins into the lane, throws it up, no, and just a bailout. That's not a foul. They blew the whistle after the shot fell off. And I don't know how long you're going to go with Jonas here because he's not getting it done. Oh, I think you're coming with Dyson Daniels right now. That's who's at the scorer's table. But if you if you take out Valen Judas, now, now Trace Jackson Davis is going to have a, a distinct size advantage in the paint. Wiggins has been at the line all night long. First one's a brick. That's his seventh attempt. He is now five for seven. Dyson in for JV. And the Pels have not been bashful about going to the small lineup. The, the issue is rebounding out of the small lineup. All right, you've got Daniels, Murphy, Williamson, McCollum, and Jones on the floor for the Pels. Second free throw. Good. 71-63 New Orleans. When this happened last night, Sacramento, you would always make a big bucket and stave off the extended run. Now, Z goes right past Green, and he blows the layup, and Williamson got slammed to the deck. Three ball, Clay Thompson. The Zion came down hard, and let's see if that's going to affect him. I don't know if that's frustration, if that's injury. He's sitting on the bench, and of course, the crowd in it, when you get those guys, those Flash brothers, doing what they do. I think Z's okay, but he came down really, really hard. 7.23 left third quarter, 71-66. Pelicans lead the Warriors on the Pelicans Radio Network. Here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude Perfect smoothie with Smoothie King. Uh, we is strong. It's my recipe. Technically, we all came up with it, Kobe. I mean, you put a potato in yours. I was experimenting. Yeah, we picked up on that. Guys, this is fruit smoothie perfection. I even heard it recently quoted that it was food perfect. <laughs> yeah, I was on the set. Oh, that was, that was funny. Oh, honey. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, get the Dude Perfect smoothie only at Smoothie King. My smoothie. Hey, basketball fans, ready to score some cash back? Tip off your shopping trips with the Ibotta app or browser extension and get cash back on groceries and more. Start with Ibotta to find offers at hundreds of your favorite retailers from groceries and home improvement to sporting goods and apparel. Then shop as usual in store or online. The average saver earns over $100 per year. Download the free app or browser extension and start earning cash back today. Ibotta, cash back made easy. Ibotta is a proud sponsor of the New Orleans Pelican. Mmm, smell that? Of course you don't, because this is a radio ad. Zatarain's flavors are so bold, you don't even have to see the smoky paprika, savory garlic, or zesty bell peppers to be able to taste our delicious jambalaya or any of our other bold, craveable offerings. Mmm, Zatarain's. Bold like that. CCI Productions is an XL printing, design, fabrication, and installation, and finishing company known for their accuracy and precision in branding spaces and events. Let their team of graphic solutions specialists provide you with professional consultation, creative conceptualization, high quality production, and expert execution. Learn more today at cciproductions.io. CCI, official partner of the New Orleans Saints. Well, when this third quarter started, I mentioned that the first five minutes are going to tell a lot because Golden State is desperate. The Pels are desperate too, but they're going to be a little more desperate at home and exactly what I feared. They have doubled this up in the first four and a half minutes 18 and nine and the double digit halftime lead has been cut to five we'll go to the state on a 6-0 run that's part of a 12-2 run overall and they've gotten the crowd very much into it which is a sellout here 517th consecutive in this building going back to oakland as well herb jones who has struggled offensively get it out long to mccullum one-on-one -on -one with Aaron with uh andrew wiggins bump spins elbow jumper no this is 
This is exactly what happened last year in the third quarter. Yeah, they've gone to the longer defender, Wiggins, against C.J. McCollum to make it tougher on him. They make another three. The roof's going to come apart. Curry going to get to the rim, try to behind the back pass, and Zion can't get it. Zion had it in his hands. I'm getting queasy. Jose in. Well, they'll just have to get back to the movement on offense. That's what worked in the second quarter. That led to the 45 points. Got him a bit, a bit stagnant on offense. Eight on the shot clock. So Alvarado in from McCollum, who's 6 of 10 from distance, 20 points. Curry flips it in to Wiggins. Pops a right angle three back to step. Short, that's out of bounds. It's Pelican's ball. <laughs> that guy throws it up. It's like it's going in. You don't, Every single, you don't feel good when you, you shoot. You, no, you don't. <laughs> no, you don't. Then why would you? All right, Herb shovels to Z. Shovel back to Murphy. Bounce feed to Z. Center of the lane. Finger roll in. Beautifully done. As far as those bounce passes and Williamson stops the run. Yeah, Pajinski fell down and then he tries to rotate down and Z avoids the contact to lay it in. 15 for Z. Pell's up 73-66. Green to Curry to Pajemski. Left corner three. Brick. Get a rebound. We can't. Jackson Five. Davis Five. literally wanted it. Five. Well, you, you got to jump. Yeah. You got to jump. You know, I think he goes over Dyson and Dyson can't keep him out. So Dyson comes to the bench. Jaron Collins talking to him. But when the Warriors are on a roll like they are here in this quarter, every missed shot, you got to rebound it. Missed free throw, so that helps. If there's a guy to foul, he's the one. 58% from the line. Well, that tells me you better rebound this miss because if it's going to be an ugly miss, this could go anywhere. Second one. Missed it. Play violation. All right, oh, take oh, foul on Wiggins. All right, that's even better. But so, but it, but Wiggins ended up with the ball. Well, he pushed to get it, but yeah. See, he's got he's yeah, pushing her. That's yeah. true. That's a little. Well, he never should have had it. Yeah. All right, Daniels Williamson, who fumbled the dribble, still has it now. Going to take it at Draymond. Scoop it out to Herb, right corner three. Come on, Herb. Yes. That is a beautiful pass by Zeke. A little bowling ball scoop, yeah, if you will. Gets the opposite corner, and Herb wide open, and Herb needed that yeah. three. Except the ball never hit the ground. Curry to the rack, high off the glass, no rebound. Wiggins stripped by Z up the floor, Herb. Herb to Murphy, set his feet, left wing three. Boom. That's how you quiet him down. That's how you force the timeout. That's how you get it in transition. You turn that defense to offense and capitalize. Timeout, Steve Kerr. 525 left third quarter. Pell's back up by double digits again. 79-66 on the Pelicans Radio Network. Hear the Masters exclusively on Sirius XM. Hi, this is Mike Tirico, and there's nothing like the Masters. Rory McIlroy, he's thinking Grand Slam. The beauty of the Azaleas, the passion of the Patriots, and the best golfers in the world vying for a green jacket. They turned right into the cup for John Rahm. It all makes for one of the most iconic weekends in sports. Live coverage of the Masters continues tomorrow at 2 Eastern on Masters Radio, Channel 92 in the car, and on the all-new Sirius XM app. Here's what you missed on Give and Go. It's a grittiness that the Knicks have that other teams just don't. They play harder. They're not the most skilled team. You may be able to outskill them. You are not going to play harder than they do. You are not going to outdog the Knicks. I respect that. Give and Go with Rick Kamla and Antonio Daniels. 1 to 4 p.m. Eastern weekdays on Sirius XM NBA Radio. Channel 86 and the Sirius XM app. This is PGA Tour Pro Smiley Kaufman, and I'm happy to announce that you can now hear me on Sports Grid Radio. Just in time for the Masters, I'm bringing my show, The Smiley Show, to Channel 159, where I'll catch up with other golfers, athletes, and celebrities. John Ralph becomes the fourth Spaniard to win at Augusta. Join me every Tuesday and Thursday at 7 a.m. and 1 p.m. in the East on Sports Grid Radio. Channel 159 in your car and on the all-new SiriusXM app. 
I have been a Taylor Swift fan for as long as I can remember. I have vivid memories of singing this song so loudly with my friends back when we were in high school. You belong with me. You belong with me. Hey, it's Taylor. For one month, listen now. Sirius XM, Channel 13, Taylor's version. Her music can connect with anybody. The biggest names in the NBA are on NBA Today with Justin Termini and Eddie Johnson. Uh, we're talking here with Nate McMillan, former Blazers, Sonic Pacers, and Hawks head coach. What's your take on NBA coming back this late in the season, coach? Conditioning is going to be the big key because you just can't duplicate, you know, playing in practice and, you know, playing in a game situation. NBA Today, weekdays from 4 to 7 p.m. Eastern, only on Sirius XM NBA Radio Channel 86 and the all-new Sirius XM app. Hey, this is Brian Geltziler. Wake up early with me in 2007 NBA coaching the year Sam Mitchell every Saturday morning from 7 to 10 a.m. Eastern as we break down everything NBA on Channel 86. In here with 525 left in the third. Yeah, Pills counter with an 8-0 run, and this is exactly what it looked like last night. Every time Sacramento would make a run, the Pills would hit them back with another run. All right, Steve Kerr goes to the bench. Chris Paul, Moses Moody, Draymond Green, Brandon Pajemski, and Steph Curry on the floor. Curry guarded by Z. Switches left hand, cross court to green, nearly walk, cross court back to Paul, right corner three. No. Can we rebound? That was good defense. Tremendous. They passed cross court twice. Steph Curry off defensively and watched him run until he reached Z. Now Zion above the arc straight away. Throw it over to Dyson right corner. Dyson will drive, spin right into the lane off the glass. Too strong, though. Rebound Green. Good move. Got to finish, though. Green going to go coast to coast. No, Throw not. it out in the left no, corner to nobody. Yeah, he doesn't want to shoot it. He had Steph Curry in the left corner, and the pass was awful. Look, you play him for the pass, which is what the Pills did, made him make an errant pass. That's 13 turnovers now for Golden State. 4.30 to go in the third. Pels up 79-66. Keep the hammer down. Z, right wing. He's going to pop a three. And he will hit a three. Z for three. That is just the sixth made three of the season for Williamson. And Z said, if you're going to play this far off me, don't insult me. Now, Curry thought he drew a foul. No, sir, off the glass. Rebound Dyson up the floor. Jose set his feet. Another right wing three. Oh, in and out. Come on. You got to get that on your birthday. That'd be nice. Come on. Well, the State hadn't scored in more than three minutes. Now, Curry pop a right wing three. That's short. Rebound Williamson. Hells up 82-66 with 340 to go in the third. Now, Dyson right wing. Guarded by Moody. Gets the movement. Back to Williamson. They're leaving him alone. They're daring him to shoot. Instead, he's top of the key now. He's going to take it right at Green. Kick it to Herb. Right angle three. That is way short. Make him right, Herb. Way short. So the Pels are now 15 of 29 from distance. Chris Paul, front court left. Carried the ball. Got a screen from Green. Drives in and lays it in. And Willie Green takes a timeout. Yeah, he doesn't like what he saw defensively off that play because oh. Pills got stuck in the mud foot-wise, and Chris Paul gets all the way in for the layup. So we'll take a 60-second break, Chris, back in the studio. 60-second break, 313 left in the third. Pells up 82-68 on Golden State on the Pelicans Radio Network. SeatGeek's the ticketing app for fans like the sideline shot caller. Come on, boys, pick up the pace. SeatGeek got him a great deal on seats right near the action. So when he yells, what are you doing? Block him! he can be absolutely sure the players heard him. SeatGeek handles the tickets to sports, concerts, and more. So fans can fan. Entergy works for the moments you live for. The joy. The heart. Here's your boy. The wonder. And if we do this, our robot should. <laughs> At Entergy, we're dedicated to powering each moment, today and for future generations. We're leading away with a cleaner, more reliable grid to power every day. Because these moments matter. You're graduating class. We power life. Entergy. <laughs> Graphic JD back in San Francisco, Chase Center. 
Hells in the first four and a half minutes of the third quarter got outscored 18 and nine. Now with 313 left in the quarter, it's 20 to 20. Yeah, so you outscore them 11 to two, and you really make basically you even out the quarter, which is what the Pels needed to do desperately. All right, Alvarado, McCollum, Jeremiah Robinson, Earl, Herb Jones, and Dyson Daniels in. So no Zion minutes here. The latter stages of the third quarter. Who's going to pick up the slack? McCullum bounce feed to Dyson. Kick it to Jose. Right corner three. It ain't his night. And it's his birthday. Up the floor, Chris Paul to Thompson. Oh, he walked. They didn't call it. He'll make this three. No, front iron. Rebound off the deck. You got a Jackson rebound. Davis got you got it. a rebound. Now, Paul, whip it out long to Clay Thompson. He's going to drive on JRE off the glass and in. 82 to 70. Don't chase him off the line for the uncontested three. He makes a contested two. And Golden State now two for its last 11 from the field. Dyson chest it to McCollum. Left angle three on line. Hit another one. Lucky number seven for CJ. And let's not forget, Christian James has scored at least 30 in four of his last five. And he's got 23 tonight. He's got 16 threes in the back-to-back -back going back to Sacramento. That's and, you man need, who, and you need more. That's the man who knows what the assignment Ooh, is. That's Paul, a foul. That's a foul. Paul elbowed Alvarado. They didn't call it. Now, they don't like each other from the Phoenix. No, series. they don't. Now, Paul bumped by JRE. Bounce feed to Jackson Davis. Whip it around left corner. Moody fly by Herb. Left corner three. No. Weak side rebound JRE. Willie Green says push it. 95 seconds left in the third. Yeah, push it, but take a good shot. Hell's up 85 to 70. Jose drives into the lane off the glass. You're not getting a birthday roll, Jose, <laughs> but he'll go to the line. He should get every roll. Oh, uh, you wish. You wish. You wish. Now he might have he might have used them all up That's on that three-pointer in the in the corner. That's true. And he caught it high and shot it right from the release. So again, Alvarado. Three points tonight on that three. Two free throws. Yikes. Pels a 5 of 10 from the Oh, line. man. Pels have been shooting the ball pretty solidly at the free throw line as of late. You're just about shooting it better from three than you are from the line. Not that. One of two ain't going to cut it in this building, though. 92 seconds left in the third. New Orleans up 86 to 70. Wiggins, Paul, Thompson, Jackson Davis and Moody on the floor for the Dubs. But Jose and Chris Paul, something's going to come to a head. At some I think point. so. Paul blows right by him. Now Herb on the switch. Paul still dribbling. Get it to Moody. Drives into the paint. Spins. Double clutch. Fall away. Ten footer. That's, that's a tough defense. bucket. Yeah, that's a tough bucket. So Moses Moody, who averages eight. Scored his first two points right there. JRE spins right, drives into the lane, air balls a layup. You got to stay within what you're doing. Thompson for three. Back on, somebody rebounded. Nope, we can't get it. We're too small out there. Yeah. We are too small. That's too small. Chris Paul, chest it to Thompson, drives into the lane, throw it out to Moody, right angle three. Yeah, they shoot a ton of them, and they're going to make some. 5 0 run for Moses Moody because we can't rebound the ball. They're not going away. McCullum weaves through to the elbow, fall away jumper. Got the roll with help of rim and glass. Screen from Jeremiah Robinson Earl to get Mitch. I almost said Mitchell Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins off him. 88-75, shot clock off. Talking Paul. about Wiggins' dad. To Wiggins. Three ball. Brick. Rebound. McCollum, that'll do it. So after all of that, you're basically even where you were at halftime. If you're the Pelicans, look, that's exactly what you need. You basically need to match whatever it is they're doing and par out to the end. All right. We head to the fourth, I would say, rather large quarter of basketball for the New Orleans Pelicans. New Orleans 80. The biggest names in the NBA all stop by the starting lineup. The legend had a storm. By the way, I'm super excited to be on your show. I listen to you guys 
all the time. So be honest. You think Frank on this show is exactly how he is in real life? Because a lot of people ask me that question. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I tell them that. I say that's exactly how he is. It's not a bit. Hear more great guests on the starting lineup every weekday morning from 7 to 10 a.m. Eastern on Sirius XM NBA Radio, Channel 86 in the car, and on the all-new Sirius XM app. They are among the greatest to ever play their sports. Caitlin Clark is the all-time scoring leader. They are legends and icons. Holly Bird hit the chop with no second thought. I know how he did it. And you can hear them right now on the all-new Sirius XM app. We are here with Iowa superstar Caitlin Clark. I'm so focused on winning it's never anything i ever take for granted here comes larry burt the hall of famer and he just won legend of the year legend of the year in that summer for access to the game's greats we lie on the leader in sports audio sirius xm and the sirius xm app the 2024 election on sirius xm the fight for our democracy that's been the work of my first term thrilled to be back with thousands of proud american patriots where every voice matters i'm as far left as you can get this president has not complied with his oath left right center decided or undecided we have to use our voices we have to stand up for what we believe the only place for every perspective and your voice about your vote on Sirius XM on the court off the court and on devices equipped with Amazon Alexa for the best basketball insight just say Alexa listen to NBA radio on Sirius XM okay we're of the NBA and the world's largest selection of officially licensed NBA fan gear with unique designs by Fanatics, Nike, and all the latest styles for every NBA team, plus one-of-a-kind products and authentic collectibles. Shop now and get today's special offer, nbastore.com, a Fanatics experience. This is New Orleans Pelicans basketball on the Pelicans radio network. Now, back to the action. Hells up 88-75 as we head to the fourth. New Orleans is 46-9 and when leading after three and 25-4 and on the road. May that continue. Alvarado, McCollum, Williamson, Daniels, and Murphy on the floor for New Orleans. McCollum had the ball knocked into the backcourt. Got it back. Now Z's got it one-on-one with Draymond. Chess it to Dyson. Fakes the three. Goes in back to Z underneath the hoop. Spins. Throws it up off the glass. No. Back tap, and there they go. Off to the races, Clay Thompson. And a foul on McCollum. Yeah, CJ fouled him. And McCollum's trying to up. limp something off. Yeah, he is hobbling. Like, hey, maybe he twisted his ankle. I don't know. He's in the retreat, and he commits the foul. McCollum just did a victory lap. He is all the way under the other hoop. Yeah, whatever it is, he's trying to run it off. So it looked like he did something with that foot on the bottom of the stanchion. But look, he ain't coming out. No way. Free throw Thompson. He can't can't afford to come out right now. Or the Pels can't (laughs) afford for him to come out. He's still trying to walk it off. So he's definitely not 100%. Free throw discrepancy is now 11 makes to 6 makes, make it 12 to 6. 88-77. Again, they blitzed us in the first five minutes of the third quarter. We were able to withstand it. Yeah, you don't want to keep living like that. No, sir. Because the momentum will shift. Trey, right angle three. Says, there's your shift. Rattles around and down. And Murphy now five of eight from distance, 17 points. Trey says, that's some bullshit. <laughs> Thompson fouled Oh, again. is that a foul? Dyson wants a challenge. Well, is the foul on Dyson know. to be challenged? Let's see. Nope. We're not challenging. See, this is going to stink. If this is going to happen every possession, wow, there ain't no foul, folks. I, I just don't think we're going to take a chance right there. But that's two now possessions that Clay Thompson has gotten to the rim, and this will be his third and fourth free throws in 50 seconds. Yeah, if you're the Pelicans, you want to hold on to that challenge because you figure you're going to need it a little bit later probably. Thompson with 15 points, four rebounds. Trace Jackson Davis about to pick up another double-double for him. He's averaging a double-double in the last few weeks. 
He's got five, and he's one rebound away from his six. Well, he's got a great role with this thing. I mean, he doesn't. You don't run anything for him. Tells up 91-79. One minute gone in the fourth. Murphy picked up by Moody. Still dribbling out long to McCullum. Shot clock at seven. CJ one on one with Moody on the switch. Right angle three. That's short. Rebound taken by Jackson Davis. And then Zion ripped it away from him and goes up for the layup. And Jackson Davis, who just got a double-double, fouls him. Well, he brings it down. And Z, reminiscent of his first bucket in Summer League, <laughs> just takes it away. That's a great call. <laughs> just takes it away from, from the opponent. Also in our open, you hear that montage of highlights when you hear Zion says, no, you don't, Beard. That was in L.A. against the Clippers. Free throw, clang. Zion can't make a free throw tonight. And he has been really, really good in that department in the last, I don't know, two weeks. He's probably been around 80%. This is a bad night to how not about, make free throws. How about his previous three games? He was 20 of 22. There you go. There you go. Got to help himself. Got that. You can't go one of two here at the line. Yeah, Got to help himself because he makes himself guardable when he can't make his free throws. All right, Jose is hounding Paul, but he got into the front court. Pell's up 92-79, 10 and a half to go. Thompson off the curl, double clutch three, brick. We don't rebound it. We don't even jump for it. And it's deflected out to Chris Paul, who's going to make a mid-range. Nope, missed it. Rebound. Trey Murphy. Yeah, when you're small, everybody has to crash but the glass. Nobody's jumping. Williamson got yeah. his pick, pocket pick by Chris Paul. Yeah, you knew that was coming. Yep. And now they got numbers. Thompson is going to stop. He's going to throw it to Jackson Davis, shovels it to Moody, missed the layup, and then tips his own yeah. missile. Zion Williamson is not going to make a living dribbling past Chris Paul, one of the all time steals leaders in NBA history. McCollum, center of the lane, get it to Z. Just throws Draymond Green out of the way and then misses another way up. They make a bucket here. We'll call a timeout. The place is going to go nuts. Thompson into the lane, out to Chris Paul. Whip it down low, Moody. Lays it in. There's your timeout, as predicted. And it's single digits, 92-83. Well, you know they're not going to go away. They're in a desperate mode. And you got to be a little bit more desperate than they are. Zion Williamson is 8 of 19 from the floor tonight. All right, timeout. Hell's up nine, nine and a half to go. Gus Cattengill with a scoreboard when we come back in the Pelicans Radio Network. This season, there's going to be a new name on the court around here because good doesn't cut it. Rates not enough. Let's be extraordinary. Keesler Federal Credit Union, the official credit union of the New Orleans Pelicans. Be extraordinary. Federally insured by NCUA. Membership eligibility required. SeatGeek's the ticketing app for fans like the sideline shot caller. Come on, boys. Pick up the pace. SeatGeek got him a great deal on seats right near the action. So when he yells, what are you doing? He'd be absolutely sure the players heard him. SeatGeek handles the tickets to sports, concerts, and more, so fans can fan. Progressive knows we're all trying to save right now. So no pick sixes, no blitzes, no sacks. Nope, none of that. But there's this cool move called a balestra. Oh, I think that was it. Or maybe it was that? I don't know. I'm still learning. So fancy tickets are cheaper than football, huh? Yeah, but hey, now we know what a counter parry is. Do we? Progressive offers you savings without sacrifice. So save big when you bundle home and auto. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company affiliates and other insurers. Not available in all states. We love the game because anything can happen. There's no sure thing. How did that go in? Every play. Oh, my goodness. Every shot. Are you kidding me? Every swing is a risk if you bet. I can't believe that just happened. There's no easy money. There's no luck. And no one wins all the time. If you bet, bet responsibly. And always set a limit. Learn more at responsibleplay.org. This season, there's going to be a new name on the court around here. Because good doesn't cut it. Rates not enough. 
Let's be extraordinary. Keesler Federal Credit Union, the official credit union of the New Orleans Pelicans. Be extraordinary. Federally insured by NCUA. Membership eligibility required. Welcome back to Pelicans Basketball. Let's check tonight's NBA scoreboard. Hi, right, guys. We're keeping an eye on the Kings and the Sun. Sacramento leads it by 10, 9, 15, and a third. A lot of time there and plenty of time in San Francisco. Guys, back to y'all. All All right. Sold out Chase Center. Back up again. We've weathered a few storms in this game. So you're trying to stave them off again, J.D. Your double-digit lead down to nine, 92-83, nine and a half to go. Well, you have some big shot makers, and your shot makers are on the court. Trey Murphy, the third, and C.J. McCollum. Well, with Alvarado, Daniels, and Jones. So we are, I mean, tiny out there. We've got no big men. Alvarado, left angle three. My heavens, not close. Ball on the deck. Taken by Green. Green. Oh, he walked. They didn't call it. Got it to Jackson Davis. I don't know how we're going to rebound out there. That's that's a real question. That's a real question. We've got no big men. Thompson. Two-man game with Jackson Davis. Drives long two. Around and out. We can't rebound it. Now three ball, Paul, of course, and a foul on on C.J. McCollum. And if we lose this game, there's your possession right there. Oh, you're too that small is your possession. Rebound. It's hard to keep them off the glass when you're this small. Circle it, folks. Circle that play. This is going to be a four-point play. We. This is huge because you're so small. And look, Larry Nance Jr. in the giant, but him being 6'8", six, 6'9", six, and able to rebound. All right, Jonas is coming lineup. in. That's too late. But this, I mean, that's a killer. This is a four-point play here unless he misses his free throw. Jackson Davis, who was going to rebound another miss if that one wasn't going to go in. Yeah, but you're up. Free throw is short. We rebounded. <laughs> wow. So now you just got you got to make them pay on the other end with Valentinus. 92 86, 835 to go. Our lead is whittling away. Somebody's got to make a big shot. Jonas left of the lane. Jackson Davis on his back. He nearly walked. Got it to Trey. We then bounce fed it right to Jackson Davis. We are melting down. Paul. To Thompson, catch and shoot three, absolutely, and it's 92-89. Jackson Davis made that possible. On the roll to the basket, they had to pick him up because he's been so effective, and that left Clay Thompson open. All your hard work is nearly done. A 10-0 run by Golden State. And C.J. McCollum takes his eyes off that one, loses it out of bounds. Game is slipping away, folks. It is absolutely slipping away. The Pels have come apart at the worst possible time with everything on the line. Everything's on the line, and you are just giving it away. Sad. 7.57 to go. Wiggins, right wing to Green. Shovels it to Thompson. Good closeout, Williamson. Thompson pops a three. Air ball. Yeah. Well, That's it's out of bounds. Do. You just crowd him, and hopefully you can get him to either take that tough shot or put it on the floor. Look, Kells ain't in great shape, but they're up three. What? What's and on? You, and, you know, you just got to gotta execute and score. That's all. We are plus 24 at the three-point arc and are hanging on for dear life. That's unreal. Williamson drives on green to the rim and one. That's all you got to do. Right hand layup. Have some patience and get into what you want offensively. You know, you got them spread out because you've got shooters out there. You're playing small and you've got shooters around the perimeter. That allows Z to work one on one against Draymond Green. That's four on green. Zion needs to make some free throws. He's two of five. Three of six. 
95, 89, 720 to go. Again, there's a world of time. Yeah, but you got your recipe. You can spread them out defensively because you play in small. Curry, head fake, step back, left angle three. 95, 92. You know how much fun it would be to watch that for the last 15 years? He's been doing it. It feels like forever. Three-point game again. Zion hard of the rim. Lays it in. Took there, it right at green. And there's your answer. You spread them defensively, and Z is either going to get to the rim and hopefully score or find an open teammate. 24 for Z. 97-92. Now Steph Curry's got the ball. you got to chase him. Oh, right through McCollum's hands. And they get it back. Jose tipped it right back to him. Paul walked. We kicked yeah. it. Do we want to win the game? Jose tipped it right back to him. Jose's having a bad birthday. Yeah, they got anxious, and he tipped it right back to him. That went through two hands. Yeah, CJ had it first, and then Jose wanted to clean up, and neither came up with the ball. Steve Kerr takes a timeout. That's going to leave Golden State with two. 97-92 New Orleans with 6.33 left in the ball game in the Pelicans Radio Network. The biggest clubs in world soccer clash at the UEFA Champions League. And it's on Sirius XM FC. What a brilliant finish that is for Mavinia. After a thrilling 3-2 win in Paris, Barcelona host PSG in the second leg of the quarterfinals with a spot in the last four on the line. Breaks the dead, but he left foot in right into the back of the net. Barcelona versus PSG Tuesday at 3 Eastern on Sirius XM FC 157 and streaming on the Sirius XM app. Merging influences from Afropop to chamber music. Vampire Weekend helped reshape the sound of indie rock and alternative. As their fifth album, Only God Was Above Us, arrives, hear the story behind it. I just started playing this riff. This had the feel of a good, simple pop song. Alongside nearly two decades of indie classics. Vampire Weekend Radio. All month in the Sirius XM app. This is the starting lineup with Frank Isola and Brian Scalabrini. When you watch Michael Porter play last year, every time he shot, I would say, no, 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 don't shoot, don't shoot, bad shot, bad shot. Now, it, he just plays, his rhythm is better, he's more connected with guys like Jamal Murray and Nikola Jokic. I think winning for guys like that, especially young players like Michael Porter Jr., I think it's changed him a lot. Listen to Frank Isola on the starting lineup, weekdays from 7 to 10 a.m. Eastern, on Sirius XM NBA Radio, Channel 86 in the car, and on the all-new Sirius XM app. The 2024 NFL Draft is fast approaching, and Sirius XM NFL Radio is getting you ready with our series of draft previews. Marvin Harrison's third TD catch of the game. Get expert insight and analysis from our staff of former players, coaches, and executives. He may be the best receiver prospect I've seen for the last five years. Sirius XM NFL Radio's 2024 NFL Draft Preview, Offensive Players Edition. Get it anytime on the all-new Sirius XM app. On the court, off the court, and on devices equipped with Amazon Alexa. For the best basketball insight, just say, Alexa, listen to NBA Radio on Sirius XM. Okay. And performing all her number one hits with special guest Nelly. Smoothie King Center, July 23rd. Get tickets now at Ticketmaster.com. Janet Jackson with special guest Nelly. For more, visit JanetJackson.com. Well, we've got to defend this ATO here. 4.9 on the shot clock. Bounce feed, and we defend it. Asking you shall receive. Steal Dyson Daniels. Pull it out. Daniels will get it to. We'll try to get it to Trey, and it was deflected out of bounds. By Draymond Green. Yeah, you just got to be judicious if you're the Pelicans. You see what your recipe is. Spread them out. You've got shooters all around Zion Williamson. Let him work. 627 left in the ball game. 97-92 New Orleans. Herb. Get it to Z. Hounded by Green. He's going to drive right past him. Throw it up. Left corner. Dyson saves it. Get into the lane. Herb. Floats it up and in with a left hand. Chicken, chicken salad. salad. Little chicken salad. Chicken salad in stereo. I mean, Zion ended up yeah, he way lost, out of bounds. Yeah, he lost the ball, and Dyson bailed him out. Oh, get there. Steph, whip it down low, Wiggins. 99-94, oh. 5.55 to go. 16 for Wiggins. Well, every, time, every time the Pels have gambled defensively and not come up with it, 
it's been a layup or an open three. Draymond Green needs an assist for a double-double with no points. Three ball Z right wing around and out. Curry, front court. Crosses over. Picks up his dribble, though. Try to be tied up. Oh, Somehow see. he still has it. And then Dyson steals it anyway. Go, go, go. Up the floor. Murphy, Euro's in. And lays it in politely with two hands. Able to pick Steph Curry's pocket. 101-94. Time becoming a factor. 5-10 to go. Wiggins, hard to the rack. Finger roll. Short. Rebound it. Herb. Front court. Herb sprinting. Herb drives. That's no call. No call. Turn back the other back. way. Turn and get back. Turn and get back. Leave it. Chris Paul's got it. Now out long Draymond. Chessa to play Thompson. Thompson right wing. Crosses over. Drives. He will lay it up. Oh, blocked by Dyson. Thompson saves it. And there's GTA to intercept. That is the 16th turnover for the Golden State Warriors. And this is the team defense that will win you a game. We're nearing clutch basketball. Williamson, right side, goes baseline and politely dunks it in right past Wiggins. Powered it in. He got the mismatch that he wanted. Andrew Wiggins can't keep him off the baseline. 103.94. Oh, we just left Curry open. We just left Curry open. Fred Vincent is going to have an aneurysm. Oh, you, you set a screen, but you got to switch out on that screen. How can you leave the greatest three-point shooter in the history of Earth that open? <laughs> you got to switch out on the screen. You have to. 103.97. Pels up. Murphy now. Step back, logo straightaway three. What in the heavens is that? Said this is Steph Curry's building, but I want some of the Chase Center, says Kenneth Murphy the third. 18 of 36 threes. Thompson catch and shoot three. No, somebody rebounded. After 22 of 40 threes last it's, it's night. It's got to be the it's the greatest back-to-back -back stretch in the history of Pelicans basketball. Easily. There's no two ways about Easily. it. Easily. Timeout, Willie Green. All right. We'll take a 60-second break. 321 left in San Francisco. Pelicans 106, Warriors 97 on the Pelicans Radio Network. Here we go. Tyler from Dude Perfect here. Big news. We just dropped our very own Dude Perfect smoothie with Smoothie King. Uh, we is strong. It's my recipe. Technically, we all came up with it, Kobe. I mean, you put a potato in yours. I was experimenting. Yeah, we picked up on that. Guys, this is fruit smoothie perfection. I even heard it recently quoted that it was food perfect. <laughs> yeah, I was on the set. Oh, that was, that was funny. Oh, honey. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, get the Dude Perfect smoothie only at Smoothie King. My smoothie. Nate Barkonce, the Be Funny Tour. I mean, Chuck E. Cheese is rough. I don't know if you've been there in a while. They look like they're trying to go to business and they can't. All new material. They filed for bankruptcy and they're still open. They called Bloodbuster and they're like, how do you get out? We want out. Nate Barkonce, May 30th, Smoothie King Center. Tickets available at Ticketmaster.com. Produced by Outback Presents. Don't miss Nate Barkonce, the Be Funny Tour. Pels have 40 made threes in two games. Again, unofficially, there's no way that's happened before. Well, but, I, I'm going to say official. That make me a liar, somebody. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's the other storyline. Pels lead 106-97 with 3.21 to go. Williamson, Alvarado, Daniels, Murphy, and Jones on the floor. We're going to ride this lineup, it appears. Here, and here, here's the thing. You cannot turn it over. No. Be, be solid. Herbs in the left corner. He's wide open. That is shooting practice at the Oscar Sports Performance Center. Herbert K. Jones, the K, stands for knockdown. Number 19 is a team. 109-97, three minutes to go. Curry just flips one up and in. Oh, look here. That's a three for two. I, I take that. I, yeah, but. That, oh. I mean, you don't like to get beat back door, but you're keeping them off the three-point line. 25 for Curry. Williamson's got the ball right wing, front court. Drives on Draymond, crosses him over. Hacked. No blood, no foul. You got to get, gotta back, on get back. Get back on defense. Curry. Step back. Left angle free. 
Must be nice. 109, 102, 230 to go. But that do makes it whether they're challenged or not. You, if you don't keep scoring, we're not going to win the game. You've got to keep scoring. It's still a three-possession game, 2.15 to go. Williamson tried to shovel it to Alvarado, and Chris Paul's head got in the way and knocked it out of bounds with eight. Now, McCollum has been on the bench a while. He's going to come back in for Dyson Daniels. Hmm. Interesting. Of course, well, you're Dyson. Look, yeah, you're looking you're losing, for some offense, but you're, but you're, you're losing defense. Now. I was about to say you're substituting out defense. Now McCollum crosses over, drives in, running right hand floater. Didn't get the roll. CJ struggled in the second half, man. If they make a three, watch out. Curry splits five defenders and will lays it in. He is taking the game over. He's got 30. And just like that, when you thought you had a chance to pull away. It's a five-point game with 150 to go. Now, these dudes have won nine to ten. It's, it's hard to pull away from them. Murphy back to Z up top. Passes it up to McCollum. Back to Z. Williamson with four to shoot. Drives on Thompson. He stripped it. Meltdown in progress. Thompson. Right baseline. Cut off. Get it to Draymond Green. Watch right back door cut. Back door cut. Wiggins. Foul Williamson. This is painful to watch. Yeah, you saw the backdoor cut coming. And, again, you know that Draymond Green is not looking to shoot the basketball. He doesn't have a field goal attempt in the game. By the way, the Pelicans are 13-15 and 15 in clutch games this year. That is dead last. And the Golden State Warriors are 23-23. and 23. They have played in 46 clutch games. Well, we've seen the Pels win a few. And look here. <laughs> They gotta hurt my feelings to see him play in this one and win one. Wiggins free throw is good. What weren't we just up by double digits like yep. seconds ago? Yeah. Yep. Just saying. Look, they got guys who won an NBA championship. Some of them several. So they don't just they don't just die. You gotta you gotta extinguish them. This is about to be a one possession game after this free throw. And it is. So you better figure it out in a hurry. 124 to go. You're up 109-106. And 9-0 run by Golden State. Dyson, drop bear floater, nowhere near. Got his rebound, though. Now McCollum in the center circle. Everybody on their feet at Chase Center. Shot clock at five. The ball ain't moving. McCollum, left angle, stop, pop, three, all line and hit! Christian James McCollum for the biggest shot of this night. That is humongous for the Pelicans. Absolutely humongous. Eight made threes for CJ. That is a challenge three. And he comes back a night after making nine threes. Now he's at eight. So timeout taken by the Warriors. There's one minute and two seconds left. It's a two-possession game, 112-106. McCollum now has 28. And if the Pelicans can pull this off, that's the shot of the season. I mean, that's a step to the side, pump fake. The defender gives you a flyby, but the defender jumps back in to challenge, and he's got the patience to make that shot. And you can see the offseason work that C.J. McCollum has put into it. I mean, he has been fantastic. Last five games, he's averaging 32 points, and he's heading that way if he can get another possession. Now... We'll come on the floor with Jones, McCollum, Murphy, Dyson, and Alvarado. So Zion's off the floor. So you got to watch can now. You, can you get a stop? Well, you're switching everything, but you got to watch the three-point line. You you don't mind the two. I agree. Because the two still allows you to have a two-possession game. By the way, Golden State's got one timeout left. We've got two. Yeah, you got to play them for the three. Chris Paul, far side. Get a turnover, Let's would you? Switch everything. Call inbound to Curry. Dyson right in his face. Step back. Three ball. Right. 
left wing. What do, I mean, that's the best shooter in the history of the game. That's un freaking believable. That is the best shooter in the history of this game. McCollum, can he answer? 40 seconds to go, we're up three. Bell's timeout. That, that's just unbelievable. That's just unbelievable. Hey, that's just a dude. That's just a dude. And you can do everything right defensively, and he still can make a bucket. 33 for Curry. He's 7 of 11. Yeah, you do everything right defensively. Dyson Daniels is there on his shooting hand in his face. You do everything right defensively, and he still can make your offense right because he's a shot maker. Here, uh, here's the deal. If you don't score in this possession, we're going to overtime because Curry ain't missing anymore. Uh, I mean, I'm just telling you right now. You know what? It, it might, don't matter where it, it might not hurt, it up. Depending on where the shot clock is, where the game clock is, it might not hurt to foul him and give him a couple free throws if you don't score. 112, 109 New Orleans. Yeah, if you score, all bets are off. But if you don't score and you can get them below 24 seconds, it might not hurt to foul him and put him on the line. Steph Curry has taken the game over for Golden State single-handedly. Single-handedly. Everything he has put up has gone in. Now, again, if you get a bucket or get to the line, whatever, it's a two-possession game again. Williamson's back into the game along with Jones, Murphy, Daniels, and McCollum. They've got Thompson, Paul, Curry, Wiggins and Green, they got their starting five. Yeah, Curry 16 points in the quarter. You got eight seconds on the shot clock if you're the Pelicans. You have plenty of time to get a shot, get a good shot. Somebody get it in the hole. Inbound to McCollum. Shot clock at five. CJ blitzed. Get it to Z. That's a block. And a blocking foul That's a good call. That's a good call. All right, now, they had one to give. Pels go to the two-man game with CJ McCollum and Zion Williamson. I mean, they're, they Three might, Green they're probably, rotates over. They're probably going to challenge us. No, they're not going to challenge. Steve Kerr looks at his assistant coaches, and they're like, no, he All blocked right. it. Now, that gives you a few more seconds here because the shot clock recycles to 14. Inbound to McCollum. Yeah, you can run this down under 24 seconds before you get a shot. 30 seconds left in the game. McCollum blitzed. Get it to Z right side. He's going to drive into the paint. He's going to slip. He's going to get it. He's going to fall and not make the shot. Shot clock is off. 15 but seconds to go. Him. They got Curry to shoot for it. three up top. No! Rebound Trey Murphy. He is called time out. No, he got fouled. Fouled from behind. Eight point seconds to go. Goodness gracious. You've got two guys trying to rip the ball away. He's trying to dig it out. He can't well, now that's where somebody's got to help him out and call that timeout for him. He's under duress. All right, now here's the deal: eight point seven seconds to go. You've got to have it. Now what? Now what is this? Timeout. He's going to challenge what? I don't think he's challenging. I think he's just calling the timeout, trying to freeze him. No, he's challenging something. I, I just, you've got to call yeah, timeout yeah, there. Yeah, I, well, you know what? That challenge right here isn't going to hurt anything. It's but 8. What's 7 the, seconds left. But for what? I guess the he's challenging the, the foul. Of a defensive personal foul on Wiggins is being challenged by Golden State. Yeah. It doesn't hurt. Well, they're following I, I him on purpose. Yeah, I don't blame him. You, you know, you, you waste it. You got a timeout anyway. You waste the challenge. It doesn't hurt anything. Who knows? You might get lucky. Trey Murphy's just got to concentrate and go I mean, make a free throw. They say, well, he's got his right left, wrist. Yeah, he, he's got his right wrist with his left hand. All so right, there's so a foul. That's that's that. So now you gotta you gotta make two free throws, Trey. Yeah, yeah. That, that's what you gotta do. Eight point seven seconds to go. Yeah, worst case scenario, you gotta split them, and the officials will take a little bit of time. But they can just look up here to the booth. We'll let them know what's going on. Golden State's out of timeouts, by the way. And you're up three. These are the biggest two free throws of Trey's NBA career. Coming up. Worst if, case, he needs to split them. If they don't... After replay review, the defender clearly grabs the arm of the offensive player. The challenge is unsuccessful. Golden State will be charged to timeout. They're out of challenges for the night. Play will resume with two free throws for New Orleans. 
You know what the ref is saying there? You know what the ref is saying? I'd love to. You know. wasted my time. <laughs> <laughs> and when he says clearly, you wasted our time. All right, Trey, do it for Miss Albita. Oh, you That's know, Trey's mom, by the way. You know she's watching. Again, these are the biggest two free throws that Trey Murphy has ever taken. And they're icing them, by the way. That's smart. I mean, you go say, what's to lose? Your challenge, maybe you get lucky, maybe you don't. Murphy's at 81%, which is basically 10 points below where he normally would be. Yeah, but, you you know, you, you put him on the line, and you see if you can rattle him. All right. First one is good. Calmly. Again, they're out of timeouts, so they got to go to length, and it's a two-possession game now. By the way, we have one timeout left, so if they do score, you can call timeout in advance. Second free throw, Trey. Boom. Calm. Calm. No fouls. Go get it, Herb. Curry picks it up. Curry crosses the timeline. Curry will drive. He is going to pop it up from the left corner. No. Rebound. Alvarado, and the Pelicans have done it. We have come into San Francisco, swept the road trip, 49-32. and 32. And depending on what happens just up the road in Sacramento, we could be playoff bound by night's end. We ain't worried about Sacramento. The Pels did what they needed to do. Road Warriors come into the Thunderdome and take one that they got to have, a road sweep after being swept the last four games on a six-game homestand, this is the way you flip it around. It is a franchise record 28th win on the road against 14 defeats, and that is now the best road record in the National Basketball Association in this season. And needless Unbelievable. To say, needless to say, the best road record in franchise history, but this is a team that all season long has shown it is capable of winning on the road. When they lost those last four at home during that homestand, everybody looked at them and said, you know what, this is going to be the end of it. There's panic going around. And those players kept saying, we're okay. There's a reason we're 14 games over 500 or whatever it was. We're a calm team. We feel okay. And they came on the road and showed it. Well, you knew Golden State was going to do what they did in the fourth quarter. They outscored us 34-26. Steph Curry at 16 points. He was four of six, but that last three straight away, he missed. People were in shock that he missed. Well, that's, but, a, that's a team that has gone to the NBA Finals and won championships. And so for the Pels to fight him off here on the road, huge. Down on the court. Kenneth Murphy the third walk off the Oh yes, sir. Yo. The whole government pre- presented. Yep, had to do it. Hey Trey, um, tell me about getting to the free throw line with everything on the line right there. Those last two free throws. Man, I... that's the birthday uh, gentleman yeah. right there. Jose hey, that's for Jose, man. I had to get a win for Jose on his now, birthday. But tell nah. me about those two free throws. I mean, nah. For me, it's just staying patient, understanding. You know. This is a big game. You know, I want to get back to the playoffs. This is what I really want to do, and I'm going to do everything I can to do that. Trey, what about the composure and resiliency of this team to go on the road, win four straight after you drop four straight at home, but you go on the road and make it right? Man, we road dogs, man. That's what we do. We get on the road. We handle our business, and that's just what we do, man, because we know we're about to start on the road in the playoffs, so we're going to do it again. We're going to be road dogs and get wins and make a far run. You know, you guys have been incredible without Brandon Ingram. Obviously, the team is a better team with him, but you guys have been able to pick up the slack, specifically you and CJ. Just how have you guys kind of stepped up your game? No, I mean, everybody just understands the next man mentality. That's what we've been doing this entire year. I mean, shoot, my entire three years of being here, we've always just stood up and, you know, Made the next step. I'm sorry. I'm lost words right now, man. We, hey, I'm just so happy we just won this game, man. That's okay, Trey. Six and nine from three, but the two free throws that Graf just mentioned, how happy is your mom going to be? Yep. Very, very. I don't add to her little collection plate. So, uh, you know, high-pressure situations. I live for those moments. So, just happy I was able to make those two. Trey, go enjoy this and watch that Sacramento game in the locker room, man. Yes, so <laughs> Well. The only thing we got to wait on now is can they light the beam because they're giving it up. Uh, The the Kings were up double figures, but look, Gus will get you on all that. The bottom line is this. 
And we talked about this in Sacramento last night, and it's hard to be. Doesn't that feel like last week? Yeah. We were in Sacramento last night, folks, yeah. <laughs> and just swept this back to back. We just swept this back to back. Just roll that around in your head. Um, when we got on that plane to Phoenix, you're thinking, "Oh my heavens, what in the world?" It did would not you, look good. in a million years. Would you believe we'd have won all no, four games on no, this road it trip? It did not look good. That looked like a team that didn't have a lot of joy, didn't have a lot of confidence. Lost four straight. One of them being to the San Antonio Spurs team that really has struggled this season. And you wondered, okay, can this thing kind of unravel here? And maybe the Pels fall down to 10th seed or you know, possibly fall out of it. But, man, to go on the road and to win four straight games the way this team has 20 or 38 the degree the in this edge. one. Yes. The chip on the shoulders, the fighting, the passion night. that comes from a thing. Really shows you everything that you need to know about the character in your team. Well,